All right, welcome back. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon. If you guys are watching the stream, the VOD replay, the, the live stream replay right now, if you hover over the timeline and you see we've done 10 raids, that means we have officially accomplished 100 total PMC raids. And our next video, spoiler alert, will be a, a story of our first 100 Tarkov raids. So that means if we hit if if you see 10 more at least 10 raids today that this might be the last stream in uh, maybe a week or so because i will hunker down and edit the new video put together the first 100 raids into a story driven video that hopefully you guys will enjoy later down the road eta of the video realistically sometime in february i'll see if i'll squeeze in a stream in between then and now but you this might be the last stream in a little bit, a little bit. We'll, we'll, we'll still stream, but I'll need time to work on the video. So, uh, welcome, welcome. Ferocity, welcome in. And we are like 2,000, less than 2,000 XP away from level 22. Uh, but the level is not really important right now. What we're trying to do is just get to 100 raids. So, if you guys missed the last stream, we finished setup. Um, I honestly thought we were going to spend at least 20 raids. I thought I was going to finish the 100 raids in with setup but luckily we finished it in 10 raids yesterday that means we have 10 extra raids today and i was thinking what task i want to do i think i just want to open up quest lines so that when we do come back from the little break uh we have we're, we're a little progressed enough you know what i mean so we'll start the day with pharmacist I actually just bought the key for 200k off stream uh, so i have the key right here bought it for 190k to be exact so we're gonna start with that pharmacist should open a lot more quests um, and then if we have time as well, we'll do a couple shoreline quests. So it's going to be a pretty chill day of questing, finishing the last 10 raids to hit that magic number 100. So uh, I could tell you guys the story of my wife. But that's a little little quick, brief uh, intro of what's going down today and for the next couple days, couple weeks. Welcome back, chat. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon. Robin, Tank, AJ, what's up? Camille, get wrecked. Howdy, howdy, howdy. Welcome in. Discover your videos, really enjoying the content. Watch your epic 1v4 and shoreline. Dude, thank you so much, yo. Generic guy, glad you enjoyed the content. Welcome in, dude. Xenery, welcome back. All right, so we are looking to do at least 10 raids today. Maybe 10 raids on the dot. I don't know if I'll do a little over, but let's get started. Waste no time. Um, we're going to jump straight into customs to do pharmacists. Tank, how much is Tarkov? 45 US. It starts at 45 US dollars and goes, and you can get more expensive editions, but just start with the $45 one. Josh, what's up, dude? So we're going to start with the pharmacist today. So for those of you who don't know what pharmacist is, it's the 114 quest. So we're going to go in two story dorms, grab the one, uh, open up 114. Grab a document, grab a case, I think, and then leave. So we're looking to do 10 raids today, at least, to finish up the first 100 raids, which will eventually be a long movie, hopefully, hopefully sometime in February, for you guys to watch on the YouTube channel. So if you guys were here, thank you so much. Thank you so much, babe. If you guys were here for any of the, so this is my 11th day of the Tarkov wipe. If you guys were here for any of the 11 days, all of these 11 days of Tarkov will be seen on that new video coming in feb so if you guys are here for any of those raids thank you guys for being a part of the recording um it's been a while since i recorded a youtube video on stream so um i, I wanted to kind of bring back that workflow to have you guys involved in like the production of it and this to, to so you guys can see how it all comes together um yeah fives we, we finished it yesterday uh I, i'll be honest i i thought i was gonna do two days of setup so i planned three streams this week Two days for setup and then third to kind of wrap thing, maybe a, a, a wrap up stream. But we finished it in a single day. We got 10 raids in and 15 kills, which was amazing. I'm really happy about it. Doesn't happen every wipe. Some wipes, it takes a little longer. But yeah, we did finish um, uh, setup yesterday, thankfully. Wandre, what's up, dude? Yeah, I'm doing good. How you doing? It starts at 50 bucks now. Oh, okay. Okay. I take it back. So yeah, it starts at $50 chat. I'm pretty invested in the game, but I have only played with mobile counterpart. Uh, is this uh, yeah, arena breakout? If you like 
if you like what you're seeing 50 bucks is it's worth it yeah fives yeah i honestly did i was uh, i was expecting a little more raids and days but uh we had a pretty good day yesterday i think i don't know i just came in yesterday excited to do setup and i think that helped with our pvp confidence but I'm being real with you guys, I said this yesterday. I thought I was going to split it into two days and do like almost 10 raids apart or 10 raids a piece rather of two days of setup. <clears throat> What's up, Ramen? Nothing much. Just getting my day started. Welcome in. Welcome in. Well, getting the stream started. My day's about to end. Right after the stream ends, my day ends. So again, for those of you just hopping in, we are entering customs right now. Get into two-story dorms and do the 114 quest. You guys enjoying the wipe so far? Uh oh, okay. Good ping, good ping. Finally got my Tarkov fixed. Had problems with FPS drops and shooting. Oh, nice. Dude, that's that's cool that our, our, our uh, reformat or reinstall just fixed it, dude. That's amazing. Five setup raid, dude. Five raids and six kills. That's doing. It's a good pace, man. Um, uh, how do I say? Is it a Des War? A Des War? Hey, much love, dude. Thanks for being here. Full <laughs> of rats. I do set up um so what i did was i wherever i spawned generally the, the the game plan for me when i did set up was wherever i spawned i would just slowly work, work my way to extract i didn't like camp dorms or anything i didn't hold down dorms or fortress too much most of my raids 90 percent of them was spawn in and then just work my way to extract and fight whatever i see on, along the way kind of worked out i did finish setup yesterday yeah so if you guys want to see the full setup run, it was yesterday's stream. Start start to finish with setup. Hey, thanks for see, catching us on the TV, my friend. Do any of these back windows... Uh, do you guys enter two-story through these back windows? That jump in the bathroom is either hard to do or can't do it anymore. I don't know if it's... Ah, people still doing setup. Could see a head just moving in though. What's up, Fred? What are we doing today? So, oh, I just saw movement right there. Right there. You see that chat? Just dropped him. <laughs> we just dropped him. I'm not gonna loot him though. I think I dropped him. We'll we'll confirm in the in the score screen, but I think I did drop him. But we are going to wrap up the 100 raids today. That's the plan for the day, chat. So we are 90 raids. This is our 91st raid. We'll do 100 raids to wrap up the story. Um, so we just finished setup yesterday. The plan generally is just to do as many quests as I can today. So that when I come back um, from my edit, for my edits in the... I don't know what's more expensive. Axel it is. Whatever. So when I come back from the edit uh, session um, of making this video, at least we're, we're at least progressed quite a bit. So 
So for, for reference, for those of you who are, uh, are not aware of the window I was sniping there, that is the three-story lobby. Like, th sorry, third floor lobby. When I say lobby, it's the, the landing of the stairs, I guess. I mean, when you get up to the stairs, you get to the top, that's the window I was, I was sniping. And if you want to find that window, just align yourself with the front door and then look at the third floor, obviously. And that's where the top of the stairs is. And every now and then, when you get lucky, like we did just right there, you uh, you get someone just hanging there in the in the middle. Thanks, exonerate. <clears throat> you prefer five for five or seven six two? I have I have moods for both. I have moods for both. <coughs> um. I think I, I'll, I'll avoid wall side. Honestly, it's picture poison at this point. I'm gonna avoid wall side. Just because uh, we, have, we have. Totally potatoed my first half mag there, but whatever. Was that what I was going to say was we could go wall side, but I just feel a little sketched out with how much action there was going down in three stories. So I'm going to go left, left side, a little more space to work in. I'm, honestly, I, I just whiffed a lot, you know. <laughs> But um, yeah, I don't really have a preference 7.62 or 5 for 5. Uh, I, I think I have different moods for both. You know, some days I'll run 5 for 5. Like, I love the AK-12, but I will say, though, you, you can't go wrong with a solid 7.62, man. You can't go wrong with, with, uh, with 7.62. Just because it's so powerful for what it costs. Okay, I'm a little worried for this cross here. We heard a lot of stuff going down in this little crossing here. What I like about 762 is the stopping power. It just has so much um damage for how much it costs. It's cost effective. Someone's behind that. We'll just YOLO throw a grenade there, see if we get a grenade kill at the score screen. Oh shoot, I, hear, I heard someone. Is that a flashbang actually? I had a flashbang, I take it back. I thought it was a frag grenade. Maybe I did have a frag grenade, I think it was we have both. Oh well, just keep going. Yeah, hawk. I 100% I, I agree. Like, um, it, you don't you don't feel the pain when you're spraying it for sure. And with the recoil update as well, it just feels so great. Solid raid, GG. We got a. Let's see if we got if, if let's see if we if we got that snipe. Let's see if we, if we confirm that snipe there. Yep, we got the snipe. Um, so that was the first guy. I'm again, I don't really care about the loot. This is the guy on the hill, the, the, the naked dude that we whiffed half a mag on and eventually killed him. Um, this was the, the first snipe through that window. Level 22 officially, there you go. Smack, good evening, dude. Hey, Fred, thanks, man. 
I'll dark test on top. Respect for using the Trihawk. I get made fun of for using it. Budget Alcan, if you ask me. Yeah, so, you know, I respect you also for using it. So the reason why I actually get the question a lot, um, Dark, as when, when people hop in stream, especially new viewers, they're like, why are you using the Trihawk? Or, or not even just the Trihawk. I get a lot of why are you using this or that. And the, the thing with the, the how I enjoy Tarkov, I talk about this a lot. When people ask, how do you not burn out from Tarkov after so long? Or how do you keep it fresh? I use stuff I'm not comfortable with. So honestly, I ain't comfortable. I'm not comfortable with a Trihawk. Um, it's not, you know, it's, it, it's not a voodoo kind of thing. You know, it's not that thing we're used to, but you just using different things. There's so many different attachments and mods in this game that I feel like you at least have to experience most of it um, before you just stick to one thing. And I just love it. I love just using things that I'm not used to and things that I don't see often. So yeah, I, I thank you. I'm glad, I'm glad you, you enjoy the try hockey play <laughs> what's up front so hi there how many hours do you have with this wipe so far <sighs> not a lot i would say it's our 11th day we've been roughly doing on average four hours a day three to four hours a day so four times 11 44 hours um haven't really been uh yeah so i i'm not really speed running at all i haven't sp sped run tarkov in a while uh it's been a couple wipes now i i've kind of made this conscious decision to not speed run so about 44 hours yeah Hey, Fives, thanks for dropping in, dude. Take it easy, man. So, yeah, it's just it's just this thing. I, I love doing this, like what I, what I just said. It's just that feeling of um, just using things that you don't, one, you don't see often or that, or I personally don't use often. Jesus. um this is my first time getting fully into the game dropped like 40 hours the past week <laughs> i love it dude hey welcome to tarkov man i mean i it's a, it sounds like it's not your first time playing but it's your first time actually committing hope you're enjoying the experience i know it can be quite of a um i'm sure you already know at this point that it's a lot of dying but it's also part of the game i always say uh panda that there we go i want to do this quest that opens up a lot but what i always tell people especially people who are just getting to the game is the, the true appeal of Tarkov, in my opinion, is you lose 10 raids in a row and then you win the 11th, right? You get like a solid kill, even just one kill, maybe you kill a duo. I don't know, whatever. You, they might be juiced, they might not be, but you finally win. It makes up for those 10 losses you just had. And that's what Tarkov is for me. <laughs> like you can't... The reason why Tarkov is so satisfying is because of the struggle we all go through. And none of us are exempted from that struggle, no matter how long you play the game, man. So I'm glad. I'm glad you're enjoying it. And uh, welcome to Tarkov, man. It's awesome. Look how much that that um, quest opens up. Crazy. And we get to turn this in. Finally, clear up some stash space for that. Woods. Shoreline markers. Already pre-collected that. All right. All right. Thanks, Tarkov. How how long will I? I I would say like maybe the average six months. This this wipe would last. There, accepted it. Um. Oh, he was not supposed to accept it. What's up, Zach? um let me just catch up with chat. what's up migs how you doing has the wipe really only no 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 it's so the wipe has not been 11 days it's my 11th day i just have not been playing every day so it's it's yeah my personal 11th day of the wipe i think it's been like 20 days or something 20 plus days uh should i get tarkov if, if you like what you see yeah it's worth it my stash is struggling needed uh upgraded badly do you, do you have a standard account you think you're thinking of uh, upgrading to whatever is uh available right now because i know eod has gone Ethan, yeah, I haven't been doing face cam since uh, since I started this wipe, and I kind of like it, kind of chill. Hmm. Ah, take your time, lol. Cucumber. Got to level 25 in a stack stash, but I'm resetting account for reasons. That's fair. What's up, Drowsy? Welcome back. Welcome. Honestly, you, you're not looting your team skills because me on some sort of spiritual level. It's fair, man. I get that a lot. I get that a lot. To be fair, Alfrental as well. Um, 
how does one get this so so this three by three you get it by buying edge of darkness but edge of darkness is a package that they just stopped selling on the website so i think the next biggest one like yeah it was it basically came with a more expensive package but i will say though um if you feel like upgrading it's worth upgrading but if you if you guys are are 50 50 about upgrading you can get through your whole tarkov career with just a standard account it's honestly more than enough to experience the whole game but if you feel like upgrading though um upgrading is worth it as well just just a little heads up for you guys who are like not sure if an upgrade is for you um frontal yes i mean that's what i'm thinking right now because edge of darkness is gone unless there's another way to do it currently if they if they put it somewhere else but yeah yeah i think this might be uh, yeah might be the last time i don't know if it is i appreciate it don it was a deep, decent face mind you yeah so we are trying to get to 100 raids today chat if you guys just hopping in we are currently at 91 we just did our first raid so we got a lot more to do yo um cat do rock much love thanks as well is tarkov pay to win nah 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 it is not uh th there's an argument that standard and eod is pay to win but at the end of the day um you you go in a raid even if you're uh, i mean if you guys have watched my streams enough you guys know how slow i progress in the game um i'm usually under leveled compared to a lot most people and we're i know i know i have eod though but the point my point is when i go against a higher geared player in in a raid it's still an even playing field i still have a chance to kill him so it's just pay to grind less but i don't think it's pay to win when you're in a raid and um you're you're in a 1v1 whether someone has standard eod doesn't matter you're fighting Hey, Frontal, no worries, man. Appreciate you dropping in as well, man. So it's, it, it will be the last stream for now, but it won't be the last stream forever. We'll definitely be back. <laughs> but back, welcome in. How do you recognize scab between actual players so quickly? F several things, but mainly um, mainly visually, like how they look, how they move. You'll, you'll, over time, as you get more experience in the game, how they move, um, you'll start to figure out where scabs usually spawn. So you'll, you'll, it's experience. Okay, uh, let me let me just um sorry chat. Let me just figure out where I want to go really quick. So we just finished customs. Should have born. We just unlocked a heck ton of quests. We could actually go shoreline. I think we have a lot of shoreline quests. It's either we go shoreline or woods. I think we we do woods first for um, supply plants, and then after woods we move over to shoreline because we have a bunch of shoreline stuff to do. But let's start with woods. I don't think I'll bother bringing money. I don't like taking VX in woods. Mm. Bring food though. Supply plans. That's triple cabin, right chat? Yeah. But uh, I will say, if you're fairly new to the game, if you're fairly new to Tarkov, that's one of the things that, that will be a little bit of a struggle is um, the, the determining scab versus PMC kind of thing. That comes with time. We've all been there. Yo, Rebel, long time we'll see. How you doing, dude? An unskilled human. What's up, dude? Hello, Rami. I love all the YouTube videos, and I've been uh, trying to adapt my play style to be similar to yours. It's paying off wonders having my la best wipe yet. Level 31 is still grinding. Yo, unskilled human. Happy to hear, dude. Glad you're kicking butt. And... Um, yeah, I say this all the time. Every time someone says they, they're trying to adapt my playstyle, always makes me happy, dude. Because uh, it's um, I th there's there's a lot of different playstyles out there, and I'm glad you guys resonate with with what we do out here. Cheers, man. Yeah, so Kappa Frontal is definitely like a grind. Um, it, it's it's a lot of hours. Like it's it's uh, I mean. I, I, I was about to say it's like a it's like a you could probably get it without no lifing it's just a lot of hours like a lot of consecutive days of tarkov and going 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 i personally think um your best bet frontal instead of getting kappa look at the epsilon container you can get it at punisher 6 if i'm not mistaken right chat epsilon is the best is the next best thing you have without having to like do kappa where you have to complete the game pretty much uh, epsilon is achievable within mid you know mid level mid wipe like when i say mid wipe mid wipe for you whatever you consider like half 
even less than halfway the wipe for yourself. If you kind of, uh, if you want to rush Punisher. Epsilon, I forgot how much space it is, but it's the next best thing before the Gamma, before what I have. How, what is it, chat? Four by two? Four rows, two column? Yeah, I think four by two. What's up, Alpha? Welcome back. Hope you're well, MW. Someone on the red was looking for new streamers to watch and myself and others three out. Hey, thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it a lot, dude. Thank you, MW, and uh, everyone recommending us. Yo, unskilled. Happy day, dude. Flying Donkey, it's up. Yes, you're live. I shall be back after my movie. Hopefully, it's still live in two hours. Yeah, we'll probably be live then. Have fun with the movie. <laughs> Wish I had a PC to play Tarkov. It took me a while to get my first. I got my first PC when I was like. Well, now I was uh, 27. I'm 33 now. When I was 27, I got my first PC. 26? Because I got a, I got a, you know, when I got a job and I started saving money, that's when I got my PC. It took me a while. <laughs> Before that, it was, you know, using the family computer, borrowing my brother, brother's laptop or something. Gaming glass into a, oh, into a small pool team. That's awesome. That's awesome, Rebel. Yo, Frontal, much love you. Thank you. Thank you, Panda. Take it easy, man. I took your advice about soloing against squads where I leave the loot and I managed to get three kills. Hey, dude, good stuff. B-dub. Good stuff, man. Yeah, that, that's something um, I, I, I always uh, try to do in, encourage people is not. I mean, I, I get it. You know, loot is loot, but sometimes it's it's worth leaving loot behind. You don't look older than 26. I get that a lot, Jeweled. <laughs> Did your brother have Tarkov? He does. Me and my brother. Are you going to focus on Punisher? Not now. Probably not now. So this is, we're just going to go Samo. Clearly getting taught, do you have any tips for me? My, my best tip, the easiest basic tip I can give, I, I give to most new players is just get used to losing a lot and dying a lot. I think that's the first step. If, if you're able to learn the skill of um, taking an L in this game, it, it's a huge huge boost uh, because you will be dying a lot and i think a lot of people get frustrated with the game when they die a lot but it's really an absolute normal experience in tarkov and uh, learn from your deaths if you could record footage record your fight see how you lost or see how you won helps a lot Yeah, I saw the gray zone. I'm interested to see how, how it uh, plays out. Always cool to have new attack shooters that are good. Hopefully it's good. So I don't really want to just bum rush into Sawmill. That's a scare. Oh, wait a minute. I thought I heard uh, a suppressed bolt nearby or... That was just uh, like noise from the impact that hit. Okay, like I said, I, I don't want to just run straight into sawmill to grab the document. I, I do want to kind of gauge the area first before we commit. It's no help hindered. Uh, neither. It's kind of like even, Steven, kind of the snow. Uh, Footsteps are louder. Your own footsteps are louder too, so you kind of hear less when you're moving around. Um, but yeah, players can be quite more visible. I think it's it's nothing too crazy. Snow has it's just a nice change of pace, I guess, but hasn't been really a crazy. Uh, no, no big change for me. Uh, in my opinion. Yeah, I'll chill at this rock for a bit. Um, see if I could just make sure. I gauge where people are a little bit here <laughs> um, I wish thank you dude I appreciate you man a lot of people quit yep yep a lot a lot of people quit playing the game um they eventually come sometimes they eventually come back but 
Yes, a lot of people quit because um, mostly uh, I feel like because they lose a lot, which is normal. Everyone loses in this game, but they're not used to it. You know, maybe they come from another game where um, it's a lot of winning and then they come into this game and you're just dying every raid and you're like, okay. And then they think maybe it's not for them because they're losing, but in reality, losing is completely normal. And uh, it's, it's, uh, the game is humbling, man. Tarkov is a humbling game. I think at this point I just go. Is it here? That's yeah, here. I'm not gonna bother uh not gonna bother leaving anything here. I just wanna get out of here before I get pinched by players here. Again, my money isn't really my priority right now. Oh, thanks, tough. <laughs> Any tips for learning extract? Just have a map up while you play the game, and then keep using a map. Like, literally use a second monitor, your phone, iPad, whatever. Until you don't need it anymore. Until you just keep having a map up until you memorize it enough that you no longer require one. I do want to go through uh, spine. I mean, the left side rather here. A little more trees to deal with. Just W King with a bolty, it's interesting. You have a teammate while you he was playing super confident, just holding that bolty out. That's why I thought there was a there was a dual partner. Because he was just uh stomping around there with a bolty. If I die GG chat, I guess. have on this Elkin. Let's go for a survivor. Let's get out. Yeah, so um, can canted sites are, are super uh, usable now. This was the main reason for for what for this build we did. So the, I built this gun like uh, a week ago or something, and the the main reason why this gun is built the way it is was I wanted to try canted sites. I wanted to see if canted sites were usable now with the new recall system and chat. It 100% is usable. ZB16. Nada. I don't know if I reloaded. Um, I mean, I know I haven't packed one mag. Did I pack the other though? Nope, I haven't packed two mags, so. I feel like I should just in case. It's not. Probably a good spot to do so. Never know. Oh, okay. That's just two bullets. Should be fine. 
two whole mags should be good enough if we come into another fight. You find any flash drives? I think I've only found one so far. Jeez, Louises. Yeah, I think I've only found one. It's not good. I might get sniped here. Where? Where? I don't know where that scab is. Wait, was he was he shooting someone else? I guess not. Yeah, I feel like that's a thing now. I think scavs chat are, are uh, they shoot without line of sight. I, that's not the first time I noticed that. There was another time where uh, a scav kind of like shot an angle that I wasn't even at before. I remember thinking about it like, is that, did he shoot me or I think it might be a new thing. I don't know. Where they, they kind of just shoot now just to be a little more human like or be a little more less predictable. Greasy, what's up, dude? Mitchell, why are you done as well? We got the quest, right? Yeah, we did. Who do we give this to usually again? Just give it back to the therapist, I think. Because I know you can give it to Skier as well. Do we get anything special? Um, uh, hers blood. I don't know if I said that right, but welcome, dude. Uh, him and man sitting at work enjoying the stream while jobbing. Hope Tarkov uh, God is in your favor today with raids. Greetings from Germany. Yo, dude, cheers, man. Cheers from the Philippines. Appreciate the love, dude. Hope, uh, hope work goes by in a good way. <laughs> welcome, man, dude. Uh, some random bird. Greetings from Germany. First time watching. Got rec uh, re oh, recommendation from Reddit. That's cool. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, whoever recommended us on I know someone in chat said earlier. You recommended us as well on Reddit, so if it was you, thank you so much, or whoever it was. Appreciate you guys, but uh, yeah, welcome in, dude. Thanks for being here, guys. Depends who I have more rep with, yeah. I, I guess that is the main thing, huh? I, just, I remember just giving this to the therapist every time, I think. Um, yeah, we have a lot of rep with both of them anyway, so I, I don't think it should. Oh, so you get more, I'll do it with X. I think I base it off of XP. I think that's what I do. So we get, we get more XP out of therapist, 7,500 versus gears. I think 4,500 was it. We get more money for, from him though, but yeah, XP is priceless. So take it. Jesus Harkov. Okay. So I think it's shoreline time. I have a bunch of shoreline stuff to do. Oh, that doesn't cost much. Did I receive that? Oh, you know what? I still have a bunch of insurance. <laughs> can I receive all? Yes, I can. I probably some probably expired, I'll be honest. I forgot to claim it. I remember one of them. A couple of them were already on the way to expire. Oh, do you guys remember when we ran this 209? Like the first couple, I don't even remember. Is it like day four or something? <laughs> the 209 just came back. Uh, I don't know if you guys remember that one stream where we ran the 209 from start to finish. 
that was this was the 209 it was right i remember it was right after a i had a really bad day of tarkov and we ended stream then the next day we got a 209 and just changed everything for us that's the same one also we got a dvl amazing Um, what are, uh, blah, blah, blah. I've been getting a lot more solo extracts, uh, Morpheus, and kills since watching your videos. Thanks for the content. I did. Happy to hear it, Morpheus. Glad, glad it helps out, dude. Um, avoiding zombies. What's up, dude? I'm good. I'm good. How are you doing? Welcome in. Should you extract ASAP if it's not in your favor? Yeah, I mean, situational, obviously, but yeah. Yeah, I mean, if something, if I just want to get out, if I'm injured, yeah, I'll get out as soon as I can. I know you don't always survive, but you make it look so easy. <laughs> I appreciate it, but yeah, we, we die a little, a little more than we'd like in this game. Um, I'm actually out of, why am I out of food? Oh, okay. Okay. This was like not full, but there was a lot of stuff here because that the Shanka was here once upon a time, but we just turned into 15 in raid to Shanka. Um, yeah, we just turned into 15 in raid to Shanka. So that's why it, it feels a little more empty now. Let me um, review what tasks we can do. Mm, okay, sorry. Uh, let's see. I, I was thinking shoreline earlier just because we have a bunch. We can also do reserve. But the thing with shoreline, we have scrap metal, which is mark the tanks. We have um, Raggy's SUV, which is at the swamp, I believe. More marking stuff. But I think... I'll bring three markers to focus on scrap metal and Raggy's SUV. So just three markers for the tanks. Are the tanks in the same position as before or at least similar position than they were before? In position cool um M mky is it mickey games however say it or regards from germany like your content thanks man appreciate you dude thanks for the same cool always stay in game uh it was yeah yeah you're not doing it you're, you're doing it right don yeah i remember the drones i was watching a friend do drones i was like where the hell are the drones how are we doing tonight what's up darth nothing much we're trying to wrap up the 100 raids today so um we are at we, we're about to approach our 93rd raid as we hop into shoreline i'm trying to think if i need anything we could take of uh, money for vx uh i don't think i'll take vx let's do the three markers make it hopefully quick and easy and um anything else meds i want to bring juice or food or something mm. a box of milk won't hurt I think we're good here. Labs are on 100. We'll see. <laughs> no, um, uh, Provid Day. Uh, do you have any good videos to on gun builds? No, I'm not a gun build kind of uh, content creator. I would suggest Giga Beef is a good one. Giga Beef is a good one for uh, for loadouts. Who else has good loadout videos? Giga Beef is like the easiest to, to think of and yeah, probably the, one of the best ones. Yeah, I haven't done Lighthouse yet just because I don't... I mean, I have a couple of quests there, but I'm kind of saving it for later on. I'm um, trying to collect a bunch of Lighthouse quests. Maybe we'll do Lighthouse when we come back from the little streamer break. Um, again, for those of you who are just hopping in, just to, especially if you're new to the stream, what's going to happen right now 
Uh, so we are th we are entering our 93rd grade of the wipe. Today we will wrap up 100 total raids of the wipe, and then when, and then I will be taking a small break from the stream to work on the next new video on YouTube, which will be the story of our first 100 raids of the wipe. So um, we will be away probably for maybe a couple weeks, just so I could work on this video. And once I release it, we'll come back to the stream. So you might not see me for a couple days, weeks, uh, but we're not done yet. I mean, it doesn't mean we're we're done. We're just uh, I'm just gonna focus on the video for a bit. Uh, I'm thinking if I if I could squeeze in some streams in between. I don't know. I can't promise it, but we'll see. Just just a heads up for those of you who are new to the stream or not sure what's going on here. Um, and if you guys are here, we have been. If you guys have been part of any of these 100 raids, you guys have been part of the recording of the new video. So hope you guys enjoyed when it does come out later on. This game is death. You're not wrong, man. It literally is death. Uh, N N uh, Niku, here goes my productivity for the day. That's out, dude. Welcome in. Um, emerge after watching your stream with AK-12. He's a dude. I love the AK-12. Great out of the box too. Did you finally finish setup? Yeah. So, um, how did you finish setup? I did finish setup yesterday, chat. We did it in ten raids. Um, we did it yeah in yesterday's stream. So, if you guys watched yesterday's stream from start to finish, that was set up all day. Um, how did I do it? So, the the basic concept of what I did was wherever I spawn in customs, I just slowly work my way to extract and. I'll fight whatever's along the way, kind of. Uh, I didn't, because like, I think one of the, not popular, but I would say one of the things a lot of people, I see a lot of people do is they'll camp dorms or fortress. They'll camp hot spots. But what I kind of did was just progress through and pick a fight that I felt like was worth fighting where where I, I felt confident. So yeah, um, that that's what I did. Just kind of spawn in, walk towards the other side of the map and see if he could come across any uh any fights along the way i i the thing is like most of my kills were like people just running past me out in the open you know because i'm just walking uh discreetly in the forest and then someone just sprints by me you just mag dump them kind of thing it takes you that long to make a video it does it does um the the, the way my videos uh are made it takes a lot of time and effort yes it does and uh people have always asked like why don't you just get an editor or why don't you just make uh you know change the format to make it quicker but the, the honestly the reason is i love the videos i make i'm very passionate about the format i do and um it, it does take a while but uh it's always worth it for me at the end of the day what's up sam how you doing a uh, drowsy carrot yes it is So, village tank first. What's up, Alex? I will bring you to Snorline a bunch of quests. So, we're going to start with Mark and this uh, tank, man. But uh, I have, I just have a bunch of stuff to do, dude. Welcome in, man. one v one Fortnite, I would die in five seconds, man. I suck at Fortnite. Yep, exactly, Arise. Just the uh, ten thousand things we have to mark, man. I think I'm gonna stick. Uh, um, yeah, we can stick the left wall because I have to get the SUV. I'm not sure what the SUV is. I just know it's. Somewhere along the... Wait, are those mines right there? What am I then? Wait, can you still run along the wall, chat? Is there still like a general wall? I just saw mines there. That's definitely new. Can you still run that wall like you used to? I have seen the farm. Um, 
but uh, I haven't really properly checked it out. Okay, so so there's no more wall, but you can still walk it as if like like just an imaginary wall now. Like it's not like a swamp all the way there or something. Okay, cool. So this replace it with one, with mines. Cool. Okay, just checking. I was too afraid to to, to try it. <laughs> okay, I'm actually not super sure where this SUV is. Is it at the edge, like northern tip? I mean, when I say north, like this side. What's up, Brandon? How you doing? I appreciate you, man. Uh, I'm good, dude. Just doing some shoreline quests. We just came from customs and woods. Uh, doing some uh, some shoreline stuff. Looking for Raggy's SUV somewhere here, apparently. Oh, it's beside the church. Okay. Oh, there it is. Okay, that's a church. Let me just scope the area first for... Frenemies. Do I just touch it? I'm just supposed to touch it, right? I don't think I'm, I'm supposed to do anything else. Oh, there it is, there it is. I see it, I see it. Alright. What's the Lord who threw his car into the swamp? So now uh, we'll go bunker first, and then um, we'll go bunker, and then drop tank. Oh, so okay, this is the drone. Okay, I mean I'm not on the drone quest yet. But just so I know for future reference. Very interesting, this redesign here. Oh, I see the mines now? Okay. Alright. Interesting. We've only done a couple of the shoreline runs, so I haven't really been able to see all the new changes and stuff. sure how far we can go here as well. I don't mind there. Hopefully I'm not out of bounds too. What's up, not Kevin? I drank one out of five vodka date me to drive. <laughs> That's why it's 2k rubles? Okay, I see. So he got scammed. He got scammed. Man, this is the new terrain's throwing me off. Where am I, bro? I just like like a full circle. Is that the swamp? <laughs> I think I did make a full circle. Oh yeah, yeah, okay, okay. That's the reserve uh reserve dome, so I think we just work our way here. <laughs> I got thrown off by the new terrain. Where's resort? Wait a minute. I'm just afraid of hitting mines or something. Yeah, where the heck is resort? Is that resort? Where am I? I'm just trying to find a resort just so I have a point of reference of where the heck I'm going. I am so lost, chat. Holy crap. What is that? Oh, that's the cottage. Okay. Cottage. All the mines are my pet. Oh, is that going the right way? <laughs> I'm so lost, man. What is this? What is this huge mountain here? So I guess the resort's somewhere here. 
these days. Or no, this resort. Sorry, this is this is is this the climbing rocks now? Is it super huge? Terraria, what's up, dude? Okay, okay. I think this is this has to be resort, right? Okay, okay, okay. So the the, the rocks just look a little more daunting now. Uh, Don, have a good one, dude. Okay, cool. That, the, the, the way that mountain got huge, uh, that climb up to West Wing, was, uh, that threw me off really hard, so. Finally made rock passage and our RX track. I feel like that was a long time coming. Oh, nice! I didn't even Whoa, realize I had a, a quest. Buena, oh, don't shoot me that, please! That, oh Sing lord! <laughs> Really good job on the Shrine Expansion and re uh, Terraform. It's a lot better around resort now, I found. There's a Reddit post asking for a fun alter alternative streamer to copy. You're currently the second most popular suggestion, which seems nice. Oh, that's awesome. Hey, thank you guys, whoever, again. <laughs> Appreciate everyone who's uh, suggested us and stuff. We'll see, though. You know, I, maybe I'll, I'll try to stream while I edit. I don't know. But right now, yeah, I, I want to stick to what I do. <laughs> but. Nonetheless, I appreciate the freaking uh, suggestion, whoever did. What's up, 62 PS? Oh, what's up, uh, Skinger? Yeah, I didn't notice the second sniper up until he almost killed me. That's awesome. Appreciate everyone who's been uh, mentioning your name in Reddit posts or wherever. <laughs> make, it 100, make it 200 raids. But, um, yeah, very, very nice of you guys. Thank you guys so much. Very fla uh, flattering and humbling check. Okay, this is not good. I think that was a player. He knows where I'm headed. He knows if it is a player, he knows I'm headed here. I kind of want to offset him and not make him think I'm actually committing to that angle or I'm dead. Yep, 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 we're getting chased, we're getting chased. So I, I don't want him to... to... Oh, good fight, GG, dude. Good fight. So they weren't at resort? I guess they came from somewhere else. That was, that was a GG, man. That was a fair aim battle. We lost the aim battle. I'll take that L. 5 for 5 PS. How much did I hit him for? Well, we, we don't really know how much we hit him for because we, we also killed a bunch of other stuff. But... Jeej. Jeej. I don't know if... I, yeah, I wonder if... Yeah, third party. So we got shot from resort initially and then this guy came from a bunker where we were. That's fair. I guess that guy did come from... Uh, he was looking for that... Uh, the, the, the SKS that almost killed me. Yeah, so what I was trying to do there was, uh, like I said, we got shot from what seemed like resort initially, and he saw my trajectory going that, you know, going towards the east wing, and I wanted to double back into like rock pass passage area and r rotate back like west side, just to kind of throw off the the guy who was potentially chasing us. But uh, whatever, Cheech. an L we shall take. Hmm. We're going to be hanging around the outside. I wonder if an SVD might be fun to use. How close am I to 100 raids for the video? Uh, we're, at, we're at 93 right now.
Yeah, that, that was a good fight, man. I really thought I, I nailed it with that dude, with the initial guy, but uh, yeah. That was a 50-50 fight. The better man won. Uh, I kind of want to, like, let's see how expensive is it to suppress this. Cannot suppress it. Right now. So yeah, I was actually thinking of running the DVL, but the thing is, I'm so what I'm trying I'm thinking I'm gonna save the DVL chat for when I come back from the next chapter of the live streams. Uh I kinda wanna do like a bunch of bolties when we come back. So I'm trying to save the bolties for that. I could MP7, we're outside though. Um we could just run the RPK to be fair. Switch up caliber. AK AK still, but change of caliber. We have PP. We have a lot of. We have enough PP and BP. Uh, we can suppress this as well, and then. Mm. Oh my ergonomics. Let's try to two X. We'll do 2x only, no canted sight. If I can find it, because I'm blind. Uh. Am I doing something wrong? The rear sight, isn't it? Am I just blind chat? What's going on here? Oh, this, this, this as well. What am I doing wrong? <laughs> Wait. What? Oh, bottom left. Oh, I'm so. S okay. Oh, jeez. Was it there the whole time, chat? I'm just blind, huh? <laughs> Does this add ergonomics? <laughs> no, it doesn't. Okay. Thanks, chat. I was just blind. <laughs> Thank you guys for the help. Mm, yeah, run this, why not? What is this? Left plate, right plate, level 4, of course. Making sure the plates are correct. Ooh, bring a bag. Mm, yeah, I'll bring a bag, I'll bring a bag. We are, like, low-key running... Uh, not running out of money. We still have a mill, but I haven't really been... I haven't bothered farming lately, so... We're, we've, we've been just banking on whatever loot we have. The game is so hard, it makes you appreciate the guys who did this in real life. For example, you can be so high scan still get folded out of nowhere. Dude, true. I mean, you're not wrong about people who do it in real life, man. <laughs> you're not wrong. Swordens. Where are the swordens I just bought? There you are. And then, um, bring that. Five. Bring um yeah, bring some flashies. One more tank to Okay, gotta buy mags. I remember mass selling a bunch of mags to make space. Really did I Oh, there it is. Bring, um, just three should be fine. So, PP and BP, we could, how much are PPs right now? We could go full PP. Um, uh, sorry, let me check ballistics really quick. I want to see the actual number of uh 
PP versus BP. Yeah. Oh yeah, sure. BP is 34, so okay. Oh, BP, I forgot. BP is now BT. Right, right. BP is like way better now. I forgot. I forgot. That's a thing now. How much is BPs? You can't buy BPs. Anyways, let's just go around PPs. PP should be just fine. <laughs> Going full PP. I'm all about that PP. What website do I use? I use, I use the Tarkov wiki. That's it. Just the classic Tarkov wiki for my ammo chart. I know there's like the other ones, like the one, uh, there's a bunch of, uh, bunch of ones out there, but I personally, I'm just so used to the Tarkov wiki, so. Just want to buy a full stack here. On. We'll be back. Okay. I think this is it. Uh, oh, we did the, the Ragi quest. Do I have to survive for that quest? Oh, we have to survive, don't we? Or is there another... Is there a part two to that quest? Did just survive? Nice. Of course, we have no space. Okay, just I had to survive. That makes sense. X one is most blinding. Preferred flashlight. Yeah, so I, I don't um just answer the question about what's my preferred flashlight. I don't really have one. I just use whatever. Whatever I picked up from raid. Boba T, what's up? I applied to college today and I want to be an editor. Do you have any thoughts or advice? Hey, good luck, man. Um, advice about what exactly? I guess the prof you're asking about the career, huh? I was a full-time videographer before committing to the content life. I was a videographer for about seven years. So when I say videographer, I used to like, you know, one-man team, everything, like shoot, edit, direct stuff. Um, any advice is, uh, first of all, make sure you love, you, you, like you're, you're, you're down to do the job because it's, it's a, it can be quite taxing. But um, get as much field experience as you can. Uh, I like I know people who like went through full like college degree of film and stuff, and people who did not study a single, did not have a single day in college or university, and are just insane filmmakers as well because they have so much field experience. Um, whether it's assisting or, or doing their own thing or whatever, I would say just get get as much experience as you can while you're at college too. Um, I remember uh, when I was still studying, I was doing freelance work as well on the side and it helped a lot. You learn a lot. Try a raid with only grenades and flashbacks. Might even turn not to be fairly budget. Um, Adrian, what's up? Yeah, I did finish setup yesterday. We did we did a whole day of setup yesterday. It was, um, we did about 10 raids to finish it, which is great. Yeah, I would say that, Boba T. There's nothing like... <coughs> Excuse me, sorry. There's nothing like getting that actual experience. Um, you learn a lot as well. And like, I, I, had, I had a degree in multimedia. I learned a lot about editing and stuff in school as well. But most of the stuff I learned was from, uh, from experience, from working. I am in Asia. I'm in the Philippines specifically. Hey, no worries, Bobo. Good luck as well. Thanks, Yasin. Appreciate you. I'm loading into Shoreline at the moment. Don't want to actually change that. That's all good, dude. You guys end up coming in the same raid. 
You guys kill me, it's all good. It, it, it is what it is. You're just better. Let's go. So we have to uh we have to mark one more tank and then and then do Raggy's SUV too. Oh, it is Dr. Disrespect back? <laughs> I love it when he plays. I love it when Dr. Disrespect plays Tarkov or <laughs> Or CS, Counter-Strike. It's so funny. Hey, M MW, good luck, dude. I got a day off work. Really hoping I can reach Flea today. The game is so scary solo. But yeah, it is rough. Flea Market definitely opens a lot for money. Gear and stuff. And questing opens up a lot. You can finally buy keys. I just bought the uh, 114 key today for 200k. Quite expensive, but worth it to keep moving forward yeah yeah Le leonard so i was lucky it actually went down i think i checked earlier like right after i had lunch today i checked it was about like 290 and then um, I got on stream. Well, right before I went live, literally before I clicked live, I bought it for 190k. So much lower now, but still, still a few hundred k's of um, still a, a farming raid I gotta do <laughs> to make up for it. Oh, we got Raggy's SUV here. Wait, where am I? Where am I? Where am I? Okay, this way. Uh, shoot. Sorry. All right. Yeah, sure. <laughs> I'm just trapped here. I t oh, there it is. Thought we were in forever land here. Let me catch up with you guys in a hot second here. Let's try to get to... Raggy's SUV without getting mag dump again. Dr. Swift played Tarkov today. He had a hard time. I think he brings bad habits from other games that don't work well on Tarkov. You know, that that is I, I, what, what um, Ruck Reaper just said. I think that's, that's the thing that a lot of uh, people do who are new to Tarkov. They bring things into Tarkov that don't work. They bring things from other games to Tarkov that don't work in this game. And... Um, you know, the, like a lot of FPS fundamentals don't work in Tarkov. You, you, you learn from other games, so it's a totally different monster, man. It, like Tarkov is its own thing, like from, from movement, to everything, to everything else, like just movement in general. Okay, we're a little early to the car. I'm, I have to watch my horizon still because uh, I don't want to get slapped while while I'm literally knee deep into the swamp here. You heard shots down there. Sounds like a PMC is just fighting off scabs. I see a PMC behind the church. I think that's the guy who was making noise earlier. He's running right to left earlier. I lost him. What is he looting? I don't know what house he's looting here. There he is in the church. Blue 
armband. He's right there. Let's wait for him to come out and see if <laughs> the shot before the death because he got our our whiff our initial bullet scared the F out of him. Get your knees out of there. Mm. I want to loot him. Yeah, definitely jump scared him for sure. I'm gonna, I'm gonna ignore the loot. He he had a VPO. Didn't look super geared. He had a VPO on tar and stuff. I know we're low on money. Like we're at a mill, but. We'll do a farming raid if we have to. Okay, a little more familiar now. Yeah, those rocks, that, that, the new rocks to go to West Wing, I love how it covers the whole resort. Hey, what's up, Seth? Yeah, we're chilling, dude. I think we're raid number four. We just died the last raid. Had a good fight, though. It was a fight that uh, we don't mind losing to. Wait, why am I still going here? I'm taking the exact same path from earlier. I didn't even have to do this. I could have gone um, bus. I I honestly autopiloted. I, I don't even have to go here. I could have cut through through a uh, kind of like bus area to the platform, but I thought it. I autopiloted for the last raid. of what happened last time I want to try to just stay out of out of sight of the resort from the get go so if you guys missed the last raid I was running in this exact spot I mean not in the exact spot but in this direction as well and someone tried to snipe my head off from resort I'm not sure what window he was at and um, I don't know if it's a common thing to do now to snipe backwards so I'm just going to play it safe and stay under here I was, a little, I was much higher earlier and someone tried to snipe us. It eventually led to our death. A lot of resort going on here. So I kind I I kind of want to check what's going on here because what I don't want to happen is as we're running to the tank, we have this guy coming down the rocks and then um, backstabbing us. So I, I do want to see what's going on here. 
Sounds like a dude fighting scavs out in the open here, but. There's probably someone there. Um, uh, Tomo. Tomo's the one. What's up, dude? Thanks. Thanks for being here, man. But it pays the bills. They'll enjoy what you do. Would love to. Uh, that, I like the wholesome conversation in chat right now. <laughs> And this is so, like just looking at the terrain, man. I this is it's making me feel lost half the time. Yeah, so um, Deef, uh, if you guys know Deef, the YouTuber as well, a good friend of mine, he just showed me a picture of um of his home, and it's just like it's just snowing. It's like this thick snow in his backyard, and I literally said, dude, that is exactly Kharkov weather right now. Hey, ch cheers, uh, Gamadin. What's up, man? A li uh, later than I did. I right, take your time, though, man. Don't worry about it. I am also kind of chasing, you know, uh, I'm talking to Pro Bong and Chad. I am kind of, as a creator, I am. I'm working on a video, so I, I have to kind of semi speed things up. But I think if I wasn't really. If I don't have a deadline to chase, I'd, I'd be much slower. Do you know when snow is coming off? No clue. I have the same question. Okay, if we get out of here safe, that'd be huge. Get two, two, uh, two quests done, period. Um, let's go this way, I guess. Hey, Salty Shirt, what's up, dude? How you doing, man? Hope Tarkov treating you well. <laughs> dude, goes what's up, dude? Yeah, I feel that, dude. You know, with the, with the new recoil update, good players are even better. Let's try to like, ignore that scav and not bother. Hopefully we don't have to. Hopefully they don't get a shot off on us, so we can just just get out of here safely. With uh, with our last roughly ten raids of the wipe. I'm not sorry. No, not the wipe. I take it back. Again, we are not done with the wipe. I'm just gonna take a little breather to work on a new video. But um, with with uh, with the last couple of raid uh, ten raids today before the end of this chapter i do want to at least make some good progress <laughs> oh this is so cool i'm just like laughing in like laughing in my head right now because of how absolutely lost i feel right now with with the new terrain like i feel like i'm going the right way one one minute and the next minute i'm like where the heck am i like, every five every five seconds every minute i'm questioning my my existence in sarkov right now
I really want to survive this one. Um, I'm t there's a I swear I thought I saw... It might be just like terrain, like parallax kind of effect. I thought I saw someone right to left towards the horizon right there. And I won't be surprised if it's actually a player since that's towards the farm. But it could also be just like a tree or a rock that looked like it was a player. But I want to play it safe and... Uh, So we take, um, what's that other extract called? Railroad. Or railroad, anyway. This is why, so for those of you wondering, this is why some people call Shoreline Snoreline. It's all the walking. Like, the map itself, it's not horrible. It's just, every time you're, you, you gotta do something and you gotta leave. It just feels like you're doing cross-country every raid. And then the most frustrating part of Shoreline is what we're doing right now. Knock on wood. Hopefully we don't die. Hopefully I don't walk on mines or something. But if we do die, it's it's such a painful thought to do the whole walking again. Like that's why right now I just want to 100% survive this raid because I am not in the mood to do all that walking we just did. It would be a shame to get armpitted by a, by a scab right now. The extracts are just so far from each other. Kind of makes it a chore to... Out of this map, it made it. Okay, Jeej. I'm happy we, we survived that. That was a lot of walking, man. Yeah, it's, it's the walking. It's, it's definitely the walking. It's styrofoam. <laughs> yeah, this is the guy we, we didn't bother looting. Yeah, Cheech. I'm so over the guessing if someone's cheating or not. It's so frustrating to never... Yeah, you're not wrong. Yeah, cheaters definitely ruin the experience in the game. They definitely do. I, I am not immune to that as well. It's, it's tilting, tilting to die to, to suspect moments. So, like, um, you guys will see in the video too, but remember... I don't know if you guys were in that stream a couple days ago. Maybe a week ago at this point. Interchange. You remember the inter interchange that got shot in the head, like, twice by an echo round, and the kill shot was behind tarpaulin. Um, I, I was so, con I was like, I forgot to check the profile, but I did report and I was like, dude, that, that's super suspect. And in, in the moment, at least with you and I, in, uh, in that moment on stream, I think you and I agreed as like, yeah, that was probably a cheater reported. I did not get the, the, uh, con confirmation back. So I don't know if he was legit or not. So I do, I can relate to that feeling of it is frustrating. Like it's not consistent. Like, was he cheating or not? It definitely felt like he was cheating, but Hey, maybe he wasn't, maybe he just. It was just clapping. So. Oh, dude, do I want to do more Snorline? Oh, no. <laughs> Eagle Eye now. So few mags, dude. What's up, Steve? I'm sorry to hate the sound of crunching. <laughs> yes, dude. I can relate. I feel that too, man. I feel that too. Can we not? Hey, Beastly, what's up, dude? Yeah, it's a hard game, man. Even even for someone like me who's been playing the game for a while, um, I still find this game hard. It's it's, uh, it's a tough one, man. But uh, it's also the appeal of Tarkov, in a sense. Something my chat has heard me say millions of times on this stream is... I always felt like the appeal of Tarkov was you 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 die ten raids in a row and you finally win one, and that that one win made up for that losing streak you just came from. But I agree, the game is tough. The game is tough, love. Um. 
Okay. Did I? I turned in both, right? Yeah, we did. So what, where are we now? We're almost 23. Review of the task. So we just did shoreline. The question is, do I want to do more shoreline? I want to walk a little more. <laughs> Eagle Eye. Primor's key. More of this. Informant's briefcase on Lighthouse. Marking this as well. Oh, dude, marking all over the map. Car repair. Ooh, shoreline. How many raids are we at? So we have about six rough, roughly six raids to go. So what I'm thinking is I, I kind of want to go reserve later, but I feel like it's going to bother me that we have these new shoreline quests that I'm not doing. Streets. <laughs> what street stats do we have? Um, Streets. So we have Primorsky. Okay, we could we could do streets. We could do streets. Klimov. Which one is this? Where do we get this? Population census. Where is this? Um, we need a key, don't need a key. Oh, it's this uh You know, it's not a bad idea, Chad. Now that you guys are calling for streets, maybe we, we just wrap up the last six, six-ish raids with streets. That's not a bad idea. Yeah, finally cabinet building, gotcha. Okay, and then it's in first spawn. Inside the office to the right, third office to the right. At the reception. Okay, there's so many spawns. We're going to have to check that out later. Uh, Yeah, I just like... It's a, it's just a chore to walk through shoreline. So I, w I actually don't mind the idea of well, what if we just commit to streets to kind of end this little chapter we have. I think it'll be fun. Let's do some streets. I just, um, yeah, just looking at shoreline, thinking about going back again after what we just did there. I am just not feeling like going back in there. Let's do, let's do streets. I agree with you guys, chat. Let's do streets. So we'll do, we'll do this and, um, I'll grab a clean off as well. Well, we'll do both. We'll bring money as well. Um, and a, and a green flare. We'll take either. Let's go. Let's wrap it up in streets, yeah? We have uh, roughly six raids to 100. And a win or lose will we'll end with a bang on streets. What are you eating? I don't remember how we unlocked population census. We had that the whole time or not. We did, um, I remember when we did those couple of streets raids. I think we did like, what, two or three raids? Man, that was so fun. I think also streets is, uh... Is a little extra fun because I'm still 
learning the flow you know there's still a lot to learn about the map and it's i feel like every corner i check it's uh heart pumping oh it's after pharmacist okay that's why we have it unlocked you're right Yeah, it's hectic in a good way. Waiting for players. Let's go. What's up, Logan Wood? What's happening here? Um, we just finished a couple shoreline runs. We are now we're now doing uh, streets to do a couple quests here. I never know where I am in streets, I feel yeah, same here, dude. Oops, I was all tabbed there. Okay. Um, let me think where I wanna go. We're at clean off right now. We just leave for the clean off, I'm kidding. Let me, let me, let me think where I want to go. Uh, we have to go west side, right? Hey, what's up, Mick? How you doing? You done with the session today? You played long today, man. Should I go deep into the, you know what? The back mall. Let's go here. Uh oh. There's a way out through here, right? Oh, the way out is upstairs. Yeah, I'll, I'll use the back, the back alley. Time uh, passed way too quick. <laughs> White rabbit hole. Glad you're having fun, man. I'm trying to remember these these back halls. Wait, is this right? This this is a breach room. It was. <laughs> Let me clear upstairs first. Make sure no one ends up behind us.
Do I use foot pedals for leading? Nah, just, just Q and E. Trying to see if anyone's reacting to my uh, killing of sniper scab there, especially from across here. No, that scab was definitely shooting me, not someone behind me. That sniper scab? He was shooting at me. It was just wildly inaccurate. Um, this is my leaning is on uh, continuous. Now you're scaring me. He might be right. He might have been shot on behind that, but I, I'm pretty convinced he sh it was that. It was us. He shot. He just kind of whiffed. Yeah, um, light keeper. I have been thinking if if I want to go deep as light keeper, I think um I'll feel it out. I it's not it, it's not a no. I'll say that. I'll say that much. Uh, it really depends on like my mood. Honestly, like do I feel like really uh putting in the grind hours in tarkov to swipe um depends yeah it'll depend man it'll depend every wipe i kind of just i don't want to over promise something and not commit to it so uh, you know you know me at this point i kind of just play tarkov by ear almost every wipe now is that a me no it's not it's not because i always have different moods With this game some days i'm feeling it some days tarkov's just tarkov i've never been here is this a newer okay, so i want to catch a breather here first get a little info hey me trolls have been see if any runners, especially from certain areas. Yeah, is this is a new new building. Pretty cool. Can you open this? I assume you can open this into like... Oh, no, you cannot. Wow, okay. This is a decent angle looking down this road. This is where we have to go. Yeah, pretty decent spot, you know? Good way to cover that whole road, especially if you're in a squad and you want to cover your boys. So I'm gonna head in here just to catch another breather. We'll stick to this wall, see if we hear any running behind or something. So I'm gonna get that full stand back. I'm gonna run. Uh, I was thinking of running those back halls. But let's just go here.
Check 15 maybe. Actually, I take it back. I don't like the spot. But we'll chill again. See if we hear anything. Um, what's up, Chris? Thanks, man. Uh, glad you enjoyed the videos. Do I use post effects? I do. It's in the description of the stream. But for the snow update, I turned off brightness. Have I encountered the new boss not yet? I've only done like... It's like probably my fourth or fifth street straight this one. Take a dump really quick. No, I was again just here out for any info. Footsteps running around my building. We'll get the uh, document. TSA, much love, dude. Thank you. We're right next to our objective building. Ooh, that's blood right there. A deep bleed right there. Someone's upstairs. I think. I heard a footstep. I'm not sure if I heard myself. Am I hearing myself? Oh, look at that. Is that a bag? Take it and extract. No, I'm kidding. Can someone boost me? Grab that really quick. I think it's a body. It's a PMC body. All right, here we go. He's going to hear this pop, of course. Yep, yep, I hear the, uh, he's prepping for me. I hear him kind of, uh, moving around. He was definitely prepped for me. He has a teammate. I'm a little screwed here. I gotta do a ton of healing. Now I'm done bleeding off the floor. There's one more chat. There's one more. It's two. I need my health though, so I can at least tank some shots from him. So if he, if he pushes this door, at least we have time to cancel. There's 100% one more. Or 
while we wait for these to heal back for more HP, pack them back really quick. Is he voiping? I think he's voiping. Yeah, he's voiping. Two seventy eight HP. We're like half HP, which is luck. We got flashbangs. That's a uh, scav. Wait, I hear footsteps in another building. Was that a player scav or AI scav? Maybe AI scav. Maybe the footsteps are hearing is another building, but I haven't cleared that last room yet, though. clear uh, it was a solo but i guess what happened there was i was seeing the scav i wonder if there's a player i thought i heard voiping btr is here Yeah, this is AI problem. The VoIP might be from the other building. I heard the, the wood footsteps are still around, but I think it's in... um. Oh, maybe this is a player scav, actually. This might have been the guy VoIPing, chat. But I know I still heard... Um, this is a player scav. This guy might be VoIPing, but I will say I, I still confirm I heard footsteps in like post office, maybe. Doesn't take away the fact that it was a player scav, and it was probably this guy VoIPing, too. Ooh, nice little... Oh, it's a founder rage back there. Until the speed. How much is a drill? Is it worth keeping a drill right now, chat? Take his bag. Fifty K. Honestly, yeah, we have we have enough meds. We have a backup AFAC in my butt. Two vectors. What the heck? Mark room gamer. What is this? Level... Level 3? Ooh, look at that SVD. We were just thinking of running an SVD earlier. I'm good, I'm good. 
You know, you could take the black rock, but I'm, I'm good. I think I'm not going to take any more than this anyway. We're almost overweight. I, I, I want to regain stamina. Wait, we're still not done with the quest. Um, let me look at the wiki. So, first room inside the second office to the right after entering. Let's check the. Let's go from chronological, at least according to the wiki. Not there. Oh, second spawn inside the third office to the right. Desk with a lamp. Oh. Reception next to the stairs on a shelf behind the counter. Please. Inside the last office, the left side of the hallway, on the right side desk. There we go. Alright, now, let me catch a breather for a second again. Figure out where I want to extract. Oh, dude, this light though. Um, a courtyard, Primorsky, crash site, collapse crane. So, collapse crane, crash site is kind of the Klimov. I can backtrack into Klimov and finish. Try to, dude. Because the thing is, clo cr crash that collapse screen quite close, but a lot to deal with. Klimov further deal with players' calves along the way. Hmm. Torn, torn right now. Let me grab a breather and think if I want to take long. Wait, oh. Where's this BTR? It's going to... This is going to clean off, I think. That... Each is going to clean off side, so I think we don't go clean off. That answered our question. Collapse screen or crash side it is. And I really don't know if... He's friendly or not. I don't have money on me. Don't I need money? Like, oh, shh. That's Tarkov for you, GG. <laughs> it's the mouse, cat, dog, dog, cat, mouse race. And we were the cat? GG. Yeah, that, that was tough. Like, it was just the pick your poison, man. It was literally pick your poison. M80s too. That hurt. It was either... I, I just wasn't... I'm not sure how the BTR would react. Maybe we could have taken the BTR. Maybe he, he goes back to neutral, doesn't shoot us. Go clean off. Or whatever. It is what it is. GG. I could have not read that anyway. So, well played. GG. It's not Tarkov without the pain, chat. <laughs> I think, remember I was talking about, I heard footsteps in post office. That might have been the guy. That might have been the guy. He, he knew what was happening. He knew where, where to hold and stuff. 
the L we will take. I'm actually thinking of taking this MP7. The thing is, we mm, we've been getting close range fights. Uh, yeah, like most of our fights have been close range. If it's long range, I'm not trying to out snipe anyone. We could take this MP7. Take this gunslinger, might as well, I guess. Um, level four, level two neck. I'm thinking of taking this MMAC, although it's gonna be stomach heaven for me. Yeah, Gij. Gijer. That was a that was a hard say. But the play was there. But I, it was still a fun raid, though. Still a fun raid. We uh, did our best. And um, the L was taken. What bullets do we want to run here? Okay, so let me check, check, check uh, ballistics really quick. Um... What's what's available? <coughs> so JSP is not bad. Do we have so subsonic JSP? FMJ JSP. JSP is pretty affordable. Oh, I have subsonics now. It has the the recoil, but then again, JSP's. Feel, it looks like JSP is just demolish, based on the stats at least. Um, subsonic twenty three pen, but you get the accuracy and recoil. What is your experience so far with the MP seven chat? Are you guys running at J JSPs or subsonics? I kind of don't mind the subsonics just because this this gun shoots out bullets like crazy, and the minus twenty two recoil plus ten accuracy might help with laser beam headshotting people so i'm actually thinking more of it's a uh, jsp for you so I'm, I'm thinking um subsonic for the laser beamy but jsp does sound uh sound juicy as well wouldn't go for chest true i think okay yeah now that, now that i think about it you're right though the thing is also we don't have a lot of we I only have three mags this is all i have this is from a player we killed we only have three mags, so I need a little more stopping power. If I had more bags, which I don't want to buy because they're probably like 100k or there you go. Maybe subsonics, but um, yeah, let's just let's just use these three mags and use JSP with the hopes that they drops. They, they drop. They drop. They drops what? They drop um, quick. Hopefully. Easier said than done. <laughs> so JSP. JSPs aren't so expensive. They're just 400 per round which is not horrible so that's kind of my my mindset is um if i like if i could fill a rig with mags maybe some sonic is the play but we can't spit out too much bullets um How come no web, uh, no webcam? Um, mainly it's just easier to go on stream without a cam. Just go live with no underwear, with no pants, and um, for the for the YouTube videos, um, these vid these raids will be part of a YouTube video. And yeah, you're on TV right now, I guess, chat. Um, green flare. 
Who, who sells against Strike? Probably you. Four, five. <laughs> I'm buying injector case. Okay, so I want. I got a mil. I got 900k chat. This is the fun. This, this is all the funds we have. <laughs> um. Okay. I think we're good. We have the meds. I need to eat and drink. How many raids have we played, chat? Five raids to go. Five big boy raids to go. Looks like the five raids. Hopefully we survive one of these so that I don't have to do a farming run. Ideally, I, I run through the whole 900k on the fifth raid. And like, whatever happens, happens kind of thing. Real quick. I want to try this in the hideout really quick. Stop it, you said, dude. Uh, we're on Or a bunch of people running MPX. I guess the new recoil update made it good. I don't know. Wow. Yeah, wow. I I almost pulled down, but I, and then I realized I don't even have to pull down. No, I did pull down, but wow. Okay, that's a laser beam. But um, at the same time... Yeah, that's... Wow. Okay, my worry here is we have 140 times 120 plus this. I feel like we're going to run through this really quick, especially fighting scavs. <laughs> I might have to go semi-auto on scavs. Sure. It does, Adrian. Yep, yep, it does. Take some cheaper ammo. Yeah, that, that would have been a good idea. Take a couple of uh, subsonics, actually, in, in the rig. That would have been a good idea, just to be sure. But, um, yeah, that was actually smart. Should have done that. So what I was thinking was uh, I might just grab a scav weapon. TGM, yeah, what's up? I, yes, you're in the right time of day. Hi, Tony, dude. Welcome back. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> the last time was the last time i'm not sure if it was the last time but tgam was here one time and he was um reacting to the stream but unfortunately it was like an i don't know how long was it like an hour or something delayed <laughs> he wasn't in, in the live part of the live stream you know how youtube works sometimes you can if you pause the stream or maybe you, you roll back and you forget to, that it's not live anymore yeah tonight he was an hour late <laughs> so yeah if you guys uh watch youtube streams make sure you are watching at the actual live moment um I noticed I remember you said something that was like okay that he reacted to something that happened about an hour ago I was like chat tell this guy he's late by an hour <laughs> yeah welcome back dude. you are live you are in the live moment of the stream uh fair TNT I sent your friend request so I could buy the more expensive ammo without you worrying about money no it's all good thank you I appreciate it dude um I, I don't really take handouts I think like the whole feeling of me slowly losing money and running out of stuff to run i feel like it, it adds to the spice so um I, I i appreciate it thank you though <laughs> how did not die but yeah <laughs> was that what you said i think that was, was that the the one in power when i fought in power i forget anyways Uh, nonetheless though the, the last raid was a good that was a fun fun raid good fight sweaty it was sweaty from start to finish just tr trying to cross streets is already an adventure in its own and we had a really good pvp fight there just unfortunately we got caught um with our pants down there hi hey, thank you for tnc appreciate the the offer 
for not taking respect for not taking fear kids that gives a better learning experience as a viewer. Yeah, I, I that's usually how I am almost every wipe. Um, at least in the last handful of wipes. I don't take uh, viewer kits for the main reason that I I want I, I enjoy the up and down, you know. I also enjoy the feeling of like 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 these raids are a little crucial. Like we're on our last five raids or so, but it's kinda crucial to survive because we're running low on gear and money. We could do farming runs, but again, we are just trying to hit 100 raids today, so we're we're five raids to go. Hopefully, I don't have to do. I don't want to. I'm hoping to not have to spend one raid doing a farming run. If we could stretch what we have just a little bit, just to hit 100 raids today, I'd be happy. I don't. I actually don't watch a lot of people play Targa, but you're a very humble dude, Andrew. Hey, thank you, I, uh, Millspec. Much love, dude. Really appreciate the kind words. Too bad I had a TT for you to use. Manchester, what's up? I like uh, your Tarkov noob video the most. Any plans? I've, I've always been thinking about doing another one, like a coaching video kind of thing. Um, well, at least I don't like always call it. I mean, I'm, I'm not. Yeah, I guess coaching is the word. But um, yeah, I would love to kind of. Uh, if, if someone. Yeah. There, yes. That's just yes. I, I, I am open to that. Um, been been kind of low key. Looking for. uh um, a concept, a new concept for it. But yeah, yeah, that's all, that's definitely something I've been thinking of for a while now to, to return to. But no rush as well. Cool gun, yeah. MP7's a good looking gun. We have 900k, which is enough, but it's more of like. I hope we have enough guns to run. We have like an AKMS in, in stash. I think we still have the SVD. We have a UMP as well. So I think um, this is raid number 96. Yeah, I think we have enough gear till the end. I do feel more enjoyment watching you than the other streamers and YouTubers just because you seem more relatable than those pros. I appreciate it. I'm glad you guys uh, resonate with the content a lot. You can coach me in 400 hours, Timmy, who mostly rats. Yeah, I'll, I'll definitely, th I'm going to think about it. I'm going to definitely sit down on it and, and think what, what you know. But I appreciate the the offer. Nice Tarkov content I see from Spain and the tire you find my ear in English. My English is devastating. Hey, dude, thank you. Thank you. Glad you enjoy the content, man. All right, where are we? Okay, this is the corner. Oh, uh, shoot. Uh, huh, okay, okay, we can go straight there. That's what spawns 12 o'clock of us here. Let me just make sure I'm on full auto here. Yes, I am. There should be a bunch of spawns to me right here. I don't know if people rush this. They might. Like I said, I'm still learning the map flow of, uh, of streets. Like, I know how to get around generally, but... Uh, the metas of which spawns are rushable and stuff is st still something I'm trying to wrap my head around. I want to grab a breather here really quick. Get more stamina. I'm if I should go here. Post office. Or go deep here to the right. I feel like here, I'm worried about all the Pinewood gamers. I have this feeling that not a lot of people are going to look out of the open here. Watch us get laser beamed after just saying that. I feel like a lot of the pe a lot of the gamers are in the alleyways and stuff, so I'm going to avoid the alleyways. I should have brought um, food. Ah, I was thinking about getting food in the grocery, but I don't really want to delay my uh, my movement too much. My move through the map, rather. All right. I'm, I'm gonna assume no one's really watching this. That's sniper scav, right? That's not a player. Yeah, that's sniper scav, 100%. Oh my lord, that scared the F out of me. Oh, that, that last shot scared the absolute.
checking the windows. We're looking good in the windows so far. Make sure we're clear here. Oh, it's here, it's here, I see it. Bro, please. Oh, no, no, don't fall under the map, please. Oh, okay. <laughs> all right, all right. Extracts. Lab screen, expo checkpoint. Oh, we got expo checkpoint. We just take a right. Oh my <laughs> So I'm not gonna lie chat, the moment I, I turned around this corner, I reacted to my shadow. I'm so jumpy. I'm so jumpy. Because of uh how last raid went. Okay, so we just have to easier said than done, but we're right here, man. This might not be the smartest play here. But then again, the, the, the concept I'm, I'm sticking to here is open areas are safer. More people in back alleys kind of thing. Hopefully that stands. That's not on me, I don't think. I think I should be good. There's going to be a run through maybe. But... um. Anything to get this out. Get our revenge. We're so close. I don't want to jinx this. Is the extract? Where's the extract? Alright, GG, GG. I'll be a run through, but it doesn't matter. Just, just, uh, that was an extension of the last raid. It's like the death never happened. We skipped the death part, and then this was the real extract. <laughs> GG. Just getting that journal out was already sweaty for me. <laughs> uh, again, just as, just because of what's at stake as well. The fact that we have limited money. You know limited gear and stuff to that hundredth raid mark and that's why that, that's why i don't take the the, the that's why i don't take uh viewer kits and stuff all that counts dude that counts for 96. <laughs> it seemed easy dude but i was sweating every corner we turned <laughs> come on dude <laughs> oh Hey, who's popping? I appreciate it, dude. So again, for those of you who are fairly new to the stream, what we're doing right now, where that was raid number 96. We are trying to get 100 raids because uh, we're going to co collect the 100 raids and turn it into a YouTube video in the future. Um, I mean, not future. Like, it's going to become a YouTube video in the near future. Uh, hopefully, a, a February release. If Jan release is possible, that would be great. But can't promise a Jan release. So we are currently in uh, raid number 96. Yes, that counts, chat. All right. That counts. I was sweaty. It didn't seem like it, but I was sweating. <laughs> Did you see me just uh, scare myself of my own shadow? Is that not enough? <laughs> I, I, I got scared of my own shadow, chat. Come on, give me a break. That was read number 96. 
Uh, jokes aside, that was a uh, was sweaty. I'm gonna bring these. F it. You're right, Chad. We'll bring extra bullets. Um. Milk. Uh, don't milk or. Yeah, milk. No, but for real as well, the, the thing is, um, I really want to keep it within 100 because 100 raids is a lot to, to go through. Um, and don't worry, chat. Uh, for, for what content you may we may lack because of uh, going for 100 today, you will get back, I promise, in a video with 100 freaking raids. <laughs> Wait, let me turn on the, the stats first before I forget. So, uh, yeah. It'll be worth it trust whose quest is this probably crap what did i get this journal for oh okay. pretty 5k rubles hey some money to work with um locate chemical lab all right let me get the money Urban medicine. I don't know this. I don't know this quest. Hmm. Okay, no key needed at least. Oh shoot, this is inside the uh, cabans area. All right, and then pets won't need it. Yeah, the vet. X-ray room key. Okay, we can't do the X-ray room key. Let's check. Yeah, Claymore City. Yeah, true. Uh, he is rarely there until we need our quest. <laughs> no, but yeah, I think we'll go for. We'll do. Uh, we'll get the key. It's worth getting that. Limov as well. Um, let me just look at this. Outside the vet clinic, front desk, the vet clinic, stairs, second floor, enter the pen area. Wait, in this quest, you have to locate and scout the vet clinic and the x rays. Oh, so it's two quests. I mean, it's two things we gotta do. Yeah, it's two. So locate this and scout the vet clinic, um, which is second floor, and then check the stuff, and then go outside the the outside of the poly clinic, which is is it just across the pet clinic? Should be right. Yeah, quite near. Okay, okay. All right, so. Yeah, we'll, we'll just we'll we'll play it by ear. Depends on which spawn we get. Let me just take one more peek at where the uh oh, there's multiple spawns as well for this freaking thing. All right, good luck to us. I think we're good. We are ready. Or a street Aronis. Let me just quickly quick take a screenshot of this loadout so I remember what loadout we were using towards the end. Oh shoot, I haven't been logging my raids today. This is raid number yeah. Ooh, forgot the log raids today. That's okay. I'll do it. Uh after I guess. This wipe, wow, really been enjoying watching your streams. Can't play myself, but then your gameplay make up for it. My favorite talk out there for sure. So positive, humble love from Snowy Sweet. And yo, dude, David, I appreciate the kind words, man. Much love, dude. And uh, thank you, thank you. Glad you enjoy the content, dude. Um, Radoslav, uh, what do you think is better for fresh new streamer, Twitch or YouTube? Legit asking. So, um, honestly, either work. 
it, it's personal preference in my opinion but what is in my opinion non-negotiable as, as a new streamer is you have to do live, live streaming has to be just a part of your content meaning it's not the major part it should be even arguably not least hours but maybe like not the most hours definitely not the most hours you're spending you won't be spending on live streams focus on making youtube videos tiktoks instagram reels you know what i mean because the thing with live live streaming in itself is not discoverable what's discoverable are are youtube videos people like tiktoks people like and stuff like that so that's the answer Um, hey Leon, what's up? Welcome back, dude. Have nice raids. Thank you. Have nice raids. How are you doing today? We're doing good. We're doing good. Today's a pretty uh, up, uh, on and off day uh, in terms of Tarkov. It's been win some, lose some, scary raids. Um, just trying to survive. So I hope you're well, man. Yeah, grow an audience first. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you could do simultaneous. You could be streaming already, but yeah, the, you want to grow an audience not through live streaming. That was my mistake. As a, I used to be a Twitch streamer. I used to stream Monday to Friday, 10, 12 hours, 8 to 12 hours a day as a Tarkov streamer from 2018 to like 2021. I was just doing that. And I grew to a certain point. I think before I started making YouTube videos, I was averaging maybe like 60, 70 viewers, which is not enough. And then um, I started making YouTube videos and it was the YouTube videos that changed everything for me. Um, and then eventually made a full migration to YouTube because it just felt like live streaming on YouTube. And, you know, this is just I, I feel like it was just better to stick to one platform. But yeah, at the end of the day, whether I stuck to Twitch or YouTube, the YouTube making YouTube videos was the answer. Um, like if I just if I never made YouTube videos, I don't think I would have met you guys who are in chat right now. Well, at least a lot of you guys. Hey, Boba T, have a good one, man. Good luck as well with the uh, with the college application and all, man. Take it easy. Been watching your stream for a while. Nice videos. I've been trying to overcome my anxiety and fear to solo. Play this game. Much love, much love dude. Andre, hope uh, hope the streams help and hope you, you get some games. Get some uh, good solo games in soon. But yeah, that that's like the, the, the general take uh, of going back to the what platform thing is. Uh, my, my main point is don't make, in my opinion at least, you know, maybe you're maybe you're a prodigy of streaming, but um, don't make live streaming the main 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 thing. It's a supplement to your other stuff. I have an old video, Siva, a very old video, but I need to update it. It's like a video from 2019 or something. Where are we going? Okay, I'm gonna clear this side first. I do need to make a new one. chat can i walk the clean off can I, can I walk the clean off and extract the clean off <laughs> wait, wait 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 maybe we can go to clean off maybe we can go to clean off What do you mean restart? Like Alt F4 restart? Do you mean if I Alt F4, I come back, I come back. Okay. Is that what you mean? Are you sure? If I Alt F4, I'll come back. Yes. 100%. This is so stupid. Okay. If the restart doesn't work. If the restart doesn't work, we're, we're going to try to extract Klimov. <laughs> okay, you're going to get a black screen chat because um, my OBS just captures Tarkov. I'm all tough right now. I'm 
One sec. It's taking a while to alt F4. Classic Tarkov. What just happened? So if you guys missed it, um, I vaulted over a little, like a knee high fence. And then as we landed, we went underground. I hope we can take Klimov. Please, please, please allow us to take Klimov. The thing is, the, the thing is, like, yeah, our stuff's insured, but because we're kind of playing to 100 raids, <laughs> I don't want to lose this kit. This kit was supposed to last me, hopefully, until 100. <laughs> oh, God, dude. All right, let's see. Let's see. Let's see if uh, restarting works. 101 raids. I mean, I think this has to be part of the 100 raids. <laughs> <laughs> oh god oh. Oh. <laughs> no we'll see we'll see we'll play it by here <laughs> oh my god dude this is this is crazy that's never happened to me i've seen the clips of this happening to a lot of people <laughs> this has never happened to me i thought i was immune to it i was like eh, that probably won't happen to me i think i should be good that was wrong Hey, what's up, Half Studio? How do you, man? Or can we like extract via sewer? <laughs> or whatever the underground. Oh no, we'll have to have the sewer extract. Like maybe we can extract through like one of those underground <laughs> extracts. <laughs> Oh god, now now we're stuck loading. Did servers just take a dump? From the US? No, I'm from the Philippines, Southeast Asia, so it is currently 8 17 p.m. on a Tuesday night here. Dimitri, what's up, dude? Good luck, thank you. <laughs> I caught this live. Oh, come on, dude. And also now I think servers are it's that time of the night, I guess. Time of the day where servers are are uh, a little painful. I was expecting to die, honestly. I was expecting to fully die. I was surprised we survived because I have seen a lot of people die to that bug. No, it's all good. I, I think it's worth a shot anyway. It was worth an alt F4. Waiting session started for almost 10 minutes. Oh no. Anyone else getting server issues right now? Without the flare? I think the flare activates the, the extract. Anyway, I have the flare anyway, so. What are the chances that the day we're trying to wrap up the 100 raids, we get the bug? We never got the bug. The whole 90, what, six raids, never got that bug. Right before hitting 100, we fall to the floor. That's fair. That's fair. Um, maybe maybe you're right. That extract's probably still there. <laughs> We're raid number ninety-seven, huh? Yeah, so note to self, don't vault in streets. <laughs> Unbind vault. I did play, uh, I played Arena the launch week. Haven't played since the recoil, they added the recoil update. White, yeah, I don't know. Uh, it looks like servers are taking a dump. He's the worst. 
Oh, there, 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 there. The circle is kind of chopping up a bit. There we go, there we go. Huh? Imagine we get banned for that. Tarkov's like, oh, he's flying through the map. <laughs> he's flying through the map, ban him. No clip band. <laughs> Is anyone in? I feel like we might be eternal loading profile data. No, no, no. We're, we're loading in. We're loading in. Come on. Give me some love, man. All right. All right. All right. We're still in chat. Come on. Come on. Look at the determination on my PMC with the music. We are determined to make our way back to the surface. If not, we may get a clean off. Bring us back to the surface. Come on. Come on, surface gods. Gaming Toto, thank you, man. <laughs> I've been falling for 10 minutes. <laughs> Look, I don't want the loot. Don't load the loot. I don't want the loot. I just want to be back on the surface. I'm actually nervous, dude. I'm actually nervous. I don't know what to expect. Dude's already been sucked up anyways. One long YouTube videos. Uh, soon you are watching the recording we are wrapping up the recording of the new video these raids will be on that new video hey posey what's up dude come on that was a good song you gotta you gotta put me on at the end of that song you can't oh it actually worked out i think we're back at the end of that song oh dude we're back we're back at the end of the song it worked out perfect I hate this game, dude. <laughs> We're going to clean mob. Come on, clean mob. This better. I hope we don't just randomly fall. I hope this is flat surface all the way to clean mob. Are we going that way? Is this... Clean mob? Yeah, this is clean mob, right? I just follow this. I'm not sprinting either. Am I going that way, chat? Yeah, I should be. <laughs> I hear PMC. <laughs> Is that a player scav? <laughs> this is so weird. Hello. I was trying to extract, man. Hey. I was trying to extract. Don't shoot. Can you hear me? Are we going lower? No, no, no. I don't want to sprint. I don't want to sprint. I don't want to know if I can shoot him through the guy. I just want to extract. 
Wait, am I going the right way? Where am I, chat? No, we're not going the right way. Where are we? Wait, wait, I'm wrong, I'm wrong, I'm wrong, I'm wrong. Oh, no, 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 we're going the wrong way. Sorry, 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 sorry. This is the wrong way, this is the wrong way. Hi. What, what room are you opening? What room is that? You there? Hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. How are you doing? Do you see me? I'm right here. Right under you. Under, under. Uh, where's, where's Klimov? Can you point where Klimov is? It's hard to explain why I don't know where it is. I know where it is, but in the place I'm at right now, I don't know where it is. <laughs> He's so confused. <laughs> Alright, thanks for the help, dude. I gotta go. Chat, this is a full raid, by the way. If you guys think this doesn't count as raid 90, number 97, this is this is a full raid right here. <laughs> this is part of the 100 raids. <laughs> oh, this is going to video, chat. This has to go in the video. This pinewood? No, no, no. This is no. I know where I am. I know where I am. Team mobs right here. I don't think we could get shot. I'm, I, I think we're legit under the. Uh, well, then again, the NPC snipers are like kind of invisible. I still feel like I want to shoot the flare. Link the new map. <laughs> what are what are my extracts? Um, crash side damage house. None of these. Clean mob is my only hope. Hey, dude. Hello. I need help. Can you take me to clean mob? Yeah, yeah. Um, I'm, I'm going to clean off. You gonna come? Yeah, let's go. should give me a, uh, uh, a notification, right? That I can shoot the flare. Hey, um, I'm gonna try to extract. Don't shoot, okay? Yeah, it's too high, I think. Should I shoot the flare from here? Is this a good spot to shoot the flare? We're past the... I think we're shooting the floor, chat. Yeah, we're shooting the floor.
All right, we're extracting. <laughs> oh, wait, the, the, the flare shot through. Get me out of here, coach. Hello, can someone get me out of here? Please. What the hell, dude? <laughs> Oh wait, <gasps> you think I can get up from that? Maybe we can get up from that. I don't think they expanded the extracts onto the underground. <laughs> Let's try this one. I'm gonna sprint now because I want to get there quicker. I don't want to walk across the whole map again. If I fall because I'm sprinting, whatever. <laughs> Man, this, this map's pretty detailed, chat. <laughs> oh. Let's see if we can use th this, whatever that is. Where is that even? It looks like uh, the, the bullets stop at the floor, chat. So for those just hopping in, we vaulted through a fence and then, and then we clipped through the floor, fell down, survived. Let's see if I can get up using that. What, what is that even? I don't even know what that is. Oh, this is like, no, this is, this is not even in the map anymore. I'm trying to see like a, if there's a tunnel I can take to go back up. Yeah, that's out of bounds. Concordia basement. Is that Concordia? Where's Concordia from here? No, no, no that's not Concordia. Concordia is... It's here. It should be there, right? And yeah, that's out of bounds. <laughs> Banished to the shadow realm for the hundred grids. <laughs> this is the expo, so that's definitely out of bounds. This is where we fell, by the way, chat. This is where we fell. Dead dude. Oh yeah, I'll probably get insurance back unless there's a cheater who just sucks all the loot. <laughs> Look at that. Are we too short for this? This is the closest thing we have to vaulting in. Too far. It's too high. Alright, first signs we gotta know if we can get in through Concordia. Is Con Concordia like straight here? <laughs> Might as well milk out this whole raid. This is why you gotta bring a rope into every raid. <laughs> oh dude, what the hell is going on? This is when you realize how big the map really is. Chat, remember Raid 97? The raid that changed everything. <laughs> Right, this Concordia. It looks like we're still. Oh, we're still too low for Concordia. You see the cars right there, chat? Yeah, it's no, it's no bueno. 
We're still a little too low for Concordia. This is so lame. What a waste of a raid. Can you shoot lights out? Yeah, no, no, we're gonna DC, we're gonna DC. I just wanted to see if we could do anything here. Yeah, we're shooting the floor. Which is worth a shot, worth for science. <laughs> raid 96 run through, raid 97 run through the ground. <laughs> oh, yeah, let's see, let's see. Throw a grenade down here, whatever. Let's see what happens. We tried relogging already. <laughs> this, this is so stupid. It, it makes, like, nothing makes sense. There's no logic to what's, what's happening right now. Over there's floor, but there's no floor. <laughs> this is so stupid. <laughs> oh, goodness gracious. Uh, Alright, we're just gonna drink this. Drop all our stuff. Well, we don't even have to drop all our stuff. I right, goodbye, JSP. I'll take my meds back. Thank you. Alright. Wiener of a game. Let's see. Let's see what happens. Bye. How far does it go? Well, found a new way to insurance fraud. Not even the cheaters can get that one. <laughs> oh, goodness gracious, Tarkov. <laughs> Imagine he tosses Gamma. Can you not about? I, I don't even, I don't know. Chat, that was raid 97, by the way. Yes, that's part of the raids. <clears throat> that is 100% part of the 100 raids. So we are moving on to raid number 98. Three more raids to 100. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> That was wild. <laughs> the most important raid of them all. <laughs> all right. That was our best kit too, chat. <laughs> that was our best kit. I'm actually thinking of giving the VPO 209 another run for its money. We had a really good time with this VPO. Maybe it's time to bring it back. We can bring the UMP. SVD still amazing too, but... For the funsies. I think we do the VPO. The thing with the VPO is we can run suppressed. And I love the VPO. I want to just transfer my mods on this gun to the VPO. That was fun, though. <laughs> Prapper. Prapper's still looking for our loot, dude. Oh, my goodness gracious. That is just crazy. I can't, man. I'm just gonna run a uh, not a canted site, just to run a 1x on this. Oh, Tarkov. Oh, Tarkov, my Tarkov. What would we do? What would we do without this game, chat? Jams, how are the raids? Oh, man, dude. <laughs> You should have seen the last one we were in, Jams. <laughs> oh, I don't know how to explain it. Where do I start? We fell through the map, Jams. <laughs> we fell through the map. Uh... 
Wait, wait, sorry. I'm checking what ma what the uh, what what bullet. I think I'm running echoes here. Yeah, we'll run echoes, not APMs. The run through. Yeah, we had a run through. How are the raids? We're getting banned tomorrow. <laughs> that's that's what. It's uh yeah, getting banned tomorrow, chat. No, but uh, the, the the real answer, memes aside, um, we uh, we vaulted over a knee high fence, and then as we got out of the vault, we clipped through the floor, survived. We fell on like an invisible floor, probably like three stories below the map. We survived it. So I, I CMS everything, healed. We tried to use an extract. We tried to see if we could extract from under, but it seems like it, obviously because we're under, we couldn't extract. We were hoping that it would be like a zone, a vertical zone. We tried to extract, didn't work. Um, so uh, we were looking, we started to look for a spot that we could vault into. Maybe the, there's like an underground area. So we looked for underground areas we could vault through to get back on the surface. We also tried restarting the game, by the way, for those of you wondering. None of that worked. None of that worked. Um, so we just, uh, yeah, we just killed ourselves in game. All right, raid number 98. <laughs> Here we go, guys. Here we go for raid number scaverns off stream now the thing is um the reason why i'm not doing so yes we could do scaverns to make money the reason why i'm not doing scaverns is i think a part of the fun of this of what we're doing a part of the fun is uh is like losing money as a pmc and then trying to make it back as a pmc as well uh that's kind of part of it it's, a, it's not a hardcore challenge but it's far from that it's just a fun little thing just to you know make raids count um that's what we haven't been doing that's what we haven't we've done like I did two scav runs. The, the other one was a waiting session start. I got kicked out. The one raid I survived, you'll probably see it in the video. Um, I, I I killed the PMC and then it was off stream. I did a raid off stream, killed the PMC and then I got, I think a gas ant off of him. And I was like, mm, maybe I don't want to do scav runs for this challenge. So I decided to like not do scav runs for the first hundred raids. So at least you guys get to see us go up and down as a PMC. And you guys have seen that within the hundred raids, the past 11 days of hundred raids, we have had moments where we had to kind of slow down a bit, use worse gear, like right now, <laughs> and uh, and try to make up for, you know, our losses. Uh, this makes it more of a fun little thing. So, yeah. You're not wrong, though. Scav runs are easy money. So what we're going to do here, chat, I am going to take a whiz and load in. Beer B.
All right, I'm back. Three raids left. So we are raid number 98. So we'll just, um, uh, depends how these next raids go, but we'll, 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 we'll try to finish at least one more quest, I think is what we'll try to do here. Whether it's the Caban one, not, we don't have to kill Caban, the, the, the med room inside Caban's area in Lexos, or we do the, uh, the, the vet either way. Goodness gracious, chat. What a day though, right? You want to talk, uh, talk about a Tarkov day? This is a Tarkov day. <laughs> Goodness. We get um, that painful death earlier where we, we killed the dude, came out just juiced. We get demolished as we exit the building. And we fall through the floor. <laughs> then Macy, it's true. You're, you're not wrong. It does have really bad coverage. Maybe we just buy the uh, the other one instead. That the, the floral armor. That's that. That's a good tip. It's got no stomach, no neck. Get armpitted. Small armor is free gear for rag. All right, let's go. So wherever we spawn here, we'll, um, Depend, depends where we spawn, whether we do the vet or the caban. <laughs> I love back shots. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, okay. What a day of Tarkov, man. So again, if you guys just hopping in, um, and if you guys are new to the stream, by the way, I, I, I hear a lot of, um, uh, so we got shouted out in Reddit, which is pretty cool. Um, if you guys are from the Reddit thread, or if you guys are just here, if you guys are new, what we're doing right now, we've been, so this is our 11th day of the wipe, and we have been recording on stream our first 100 raids of the wipe. And these 100 raids will be turned into a story driven video. Which, which I will start production right after the stream. So it doesn't mean we're not streaming again, but I will be taking a quick break from the streams to focus on this video. Um, I'm thinking about maybe squeeze. I don't know if I'll be able to squeeze in a couple streams. Maybe I'll take a day off from editing, do a quick stream, um, do a quest or two or something. I don't know. Maybe that's an option, but my priority after this, my number one priority will be working on that new video. And um, we are currently in raid number 98. We have a call, uh, so after this 98 99 100 so we're three rates to go before we hit 100 um we're trying to do just one more quest uh wait 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 oh i i don't actually know where i'm going right now um let me think caban's keys uh and the vet i just need my bearings so we're at nikita caban's key is to the left to the west and that so it's all west it's all west He was looking at me. Uh, I don't know if he has range. I don't want to risk it. Mm. I think I disengaged from that. We look for another way around.
Okay, diner. So I just gotta keep working west. It's actually not a bad route that we took here. I'm just worried about getting backstabbed by that dude. Makes sense, right, what I'm doing? I think it does. No one looks out on their main road, chat. Sniper scab is protecting us. Alright, hopefully no advanced keys here. Let's get a breather here. Alright, alright, we're going the right way. So I want to enter through here. Um, I, have, I might have to kill Sniper Scav if he might shoot us in the back. I'm gonna get in this cafe for a second. That's what's up, dude. Nothing much. We're just trying to um, trying to do some streets quests. How you doing? We're going to Caban's uh, house. Lexos. I gotta go in that little. Medical room. Loot something. tough part is as, as soon as I get in there, I have to all time refer to the wiki. I'm not entirely sure where, where the thing is. I swear you could crotch through that, right? That little corner. Anyways, okay, we're in. I'll tab really quick. Uh, urban medicine. God, dude. First spawn. Just one thing. Yeah, just one thing, right? Okay, first try. Nice. Okay, I need bearings to find my extract. Collapse train, clean of. Um, so I'm in Lexos. Collapse cranes. Do I have a. Uh, collapse crane, clean of street. Oh, I don't bring my. Shoot. Collapse. I think we go collapse crane. Don't hit a mine, don't hit a mine. I think he disconnected. Let's just run. I don't know if he has a teammate. The reason I'm not shooting him, I don't know if he has a teammate. That's um kind of holding his body and like gonna bait us into it.
catch a breather. We gotta deal with all these scabs though. AKS. Okay, we have uh, two more raids. We'll, we'll try to do the other one. <clears throat> two more raids. So we're 99. We're approaching raid 99 and 100 here. I think that was an AKS. Let's see what bullets he had. Yeah, I, I really didn't want to risk it there. Just us getting really lucky that... Um, we were uncontested in Lexus and everything. I didn't want to take my chance. Yeah, it was 5 for 5 US. Probably a player scav. I don't want to risk losing that and having to go all the way to Lexus again. That's what I appreciate about streets, though. I will say that the little things it may, the little things in streets makes raids fun there. Even if, like, we had a couple of raids today just getting out of the quest with no PvP and it's, it was still sweaty as heck. That was, that was nerve-wracking. Let's do the um let's see what what this unlocks and then maybe we could do the vet as well. Just get a little more XP. But I like this. I'm glad you guys suggested um I'm I'm happy you guys suggested oh look my setup gear. Streets to, to wrap things up because I was thinking of just, you know, doing doing like the usual, but Streets has been fun, man. Good suggestion. I didn't even think of that. You're not wrong. 366 is, a, is a great. Especially this white man. I just want to liquidate little money. Okay. Here in the back. Um, wait, turn it in first. I might forget. Um, who was this? Oh, it's probably therapist, a medical thing. And then, um, did I unlock anything else? No. So, we'll, we'll look at streets. We'll just, um, click on streets. Dangerous road. Um, so same. It's either Klimov, this, but let's focus on this one. Let's focus on this one. So, locate vet and, and all that. Hmm, I kind of want to take range now. With the little money we made, I'm thinking of um, spoiling ourselves a bit. Um, run a do the do the the swamp fox setup has been working for us honestly. The trihawk. Spoil ourselves.
Seems fair. I'll be honest though, the VPO is a little banged up. Trust in the VPO. It's not gonna. We're 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 not gonna jam. We'll be fine. Just gotta trust it. All trust in the VPO. I like the setup. Quick screenshot. Okay, while we load it, I'm going to review where we have to go. Did I, do I have the x-ray key on me? I do, I do, I do. I do, right? I 100% do. I never took it off of myself. So vet clinic, um, x-ray control room. So we got to go far west. Um... So inside the vet clinic, we just have to go second floor, touch the thing. So x-ray room, we just have to touch it as well. Question, if I got a task that says find and raid, can I like make them in my hideout? Like, my yes, yes. So um, feudal, feudal, feudal gotcha. So crafting anything in your hideout gives the item a found and raid status. So yes, you nailed it, my friend. <laughs> What's up, Josh? Uh, hey, Ramen. My friend sent me your way to learn Tarkov. Any tips for real newbies except for do the quests? Um, outside of doing the quest, the other top advice I give a lot of new players is get used to dying a lot. Get used to losing a lot. When you do, it, um, if you're able to kind of be okay with losing and trying, trying to learn from your losses, you, I think it's a huge skill to have in Tarkov. Because a lot of people will play Tarkov and eventually burn out and quit because they're just not used to losing a lot in this game because you know, they might come from another video game where they're pretty decent at and it's a lot of winning when you're good at a certain game um and in Tarkov it like really humbles you so yeah if, if you if you can take the L in Tarkov I think improvement is tenfold I've run 144 FPS and 144 Hertz monitor when my FPS and when my FPS drops 100 to 90, I feel some stuttering and laggy when move. It doesn't feel smooth rage. The quickest thing I could say is a hardware thing. I mean, you might have a good PC, but Tarkov is Tarkov as well. So um, that, that's my take on it. It might be a hardware thing. If it's not a hardware thing and you're convinced your, your PC should be able to handle it. I mean, it might be a hassle, but a reinstall of either Windows or Tarkov might help. No worries, Josh. Still have uh, having fun with the game, but not getting level up fast two weeks. Got only rep. So take your time, feud, feudal. It'll be fine. Take your time with it. MW, thanks for hanging, my friend. Appreciate you. Glad you caught caught all the craziness of the stream. But time from editor that. Hey, Gaspar, what's up, dude? I'm good. Just I'm um, wrapping up our hundred raids of the wipe. First hundred raids of the wipe. Hey, what's up, Benji? Welcome back, man. So for those of you just hopping in, we are currently in raid number 99. Two raids to go before hitting 100. Um, you have to do ground zero tasks to advance. Yes. Do, you have to do, you're forced to do ground zero tasks first. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to get in here quick. Mainly for... If someone pushes this on here... it no you just start with ground zero have you accepted the quests
checking the map. Oh, I'm trying to get my bearings. We are cinema, which is bottom right. So we got to go west. Go to the vet clinic. We could go through cinema. Matt's on. Much love, dude. Thank you. Glad you enjoyed the content, man. Welcome. I thought there was a dude, it was a poster with people on it. I'm, I'm trying to think where I want to cross to. I don't want to go here because I'm going to have to get to go through Concordia and Crane, which is a... You know what? I think. I take it back. I think I do want to go here. The path I'm going to take... It's honestly pick your poison. There's no, like, safe way out. There's nothing safe in Tarkov. But what I'm thinking is I'm going to go here to the back, into the Concordia area. Then uh, get into the grocery, the Sparja, however you say it, Sparha. And then cross from there, maybe. I thought I heard someone behind me. I swear I heard someone. be tripping I think I'm tripping I was tripping I, I had to make sure man I was like I was so 50-50 Are there mines here? Hopefully not. Hey, morning, Tristan. Welcome back, dude.
Mm, that's from where I came from. I just dropped them. Whatever. Just finding someone else's lead. Shoot, is it a BTR? Oh boy, I don't know what that means. Um, how do I know if it's like hostile or not? I guess that's the fun part, we never really know. So, I need to cross here to get my quest done, chat. Expo's there as well. Extract is there as well. That's behind. That's the... Oh, okay. It's hostile. It's shooting something. I'm going to the back. in here it shot something right or was that the machine gun was that a player shooting not the btr how much is it to to escort chat They're shooting. Okay, paranoia. There's a player inside the fence. thing is sounds like this guy either died to those scabs or he's just stuck in a corner so I think I'll take this time since he's pinned to move but I have to worry about him popping out So that's not it. A lot of dead things out here. Oh, here. I was about to cross.
next up um where's the vet that should be like across me right oh wait no this is the vet sorry the x-ray room oh, sorry we're, we're in the vet the x-ray room is that's a school it's not in there i don't remember where it is it's another building oh the left of the school right chat I gotta at least hug the school wall. Wait, where is it? I'm so lost, I'll be honest. Is it to my right here? Oh, this one, this one. Oh god. <laughs> so jumpy, I flicked so hard, Chad, to that plant. I've never been so scared of my life. Streets does this to me. Someone's been here. Airdrop. Oh, that's not good, dude. Airdrop is towards my extra. Shitting me, dude. to the right no way dudes okay are you kidding me you're really gonna put the airdrop right in my extract unbelievable this is Tarkov being absolutely Tarkov to me right now. Oh no, no vaulting in this area, right? Remember, chat, don't vault. Trade number 99. <laughs> oh. Oh. Dude, it's worth it. You guys, you guys love the pain, man. We've had enough pain for the day. My kneecaps still hurt from falling under the map, chat. By GG and GG. Great raid. So we killed a bear early. He had a Yashanka and a pistol. Let's see. Is it a 0 to 10 or 11 to 20? It is a 11 to 30, rather. 
Okay, I mean not. I mean I'm 11 to 30, so fair game. He had a Yashanka and a pistol, I think. <laughs> the dude we sniped. All right, I think to uh, go out with a bang. I just get some PVP for this last. Um, let's for raid number 100. I think we've we've. I think it's cool. We got a quest done. Raid 98, raid 99. I think raid 100. Let's go straight to Tarkov again. See if we just get a nice fight. I really wanted to sort of like try hard to get this task done because we are at 99 and there we go. At least we get this done at 99 and then 100, we can just do whatever we want. Um, I think you guys are right though about, I remember you guys talking about armor earlier, so let's change armor. Labs. <laughs> to end it all. Green bag doesn't do it. I mean, black bag doesn't do it. I'll stick, we'll stick the streets. I love streets. Also, we'll take the VPO because the VPO... I think the thing with the VPO chat, it, it's, it has a special place in our heart for these 100 raids because... It got us this. Uh, this is the same VPO that got me out of a really bad rut. I think day three or four, we lost like all day one of those days. And then this is the gun that brought us back to life. And I think it 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 it's uh it deserves a celebratory raid out as well, whether we win it or we lose it. Win with it or lose it. So I, I was thinking like, okay, let's spend the 700 key on a new gun or something. Maybe run the SVD. But I think um, the VPO 209 deserves a a proper salute. Super love this gun. <laughs> this wipe at least. It's been so fun. All right. Um, where's my? What was I thinking? Let's bring a Klimov and uh, and money just for VX. Eat, drink, celebratory hot rod, I guess. Let's bring a milk as well. What the hell did I just type? <laughs> nah, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go streets chat. I really want to do streets. <laughs> Vote. Now, nah. I'm gonna go streets. I'm sorry, guys. The streets run. Bring all my grenades, which is an extra one. <laughs> this is an extra one grenade. Um, actually, we, looks like we have more. Where's that other one little grenade? Um, oh, it's a smoke grenade. No, oh, thank you. All right, let's do it. One for the road chat. I see how it goes. This could go either way. This is that of spawn or best fight ever. This deserves to be insured. Oh, before anything, I need a screenshot. This guy's probably going to be in the thumbnail here. <laughs> He's probably going to be in the thumbnail. He deserves to be insured. The unsung hero, man. Quick show of overall. Sorry, I missed that. Um, is there a right or wrong way to sort your stash? No, no, absolutely not. I mean, you just have like, if you're like me and you have a garbage stash, you just have to be open to criticism. That's it. <laughs> because as a streamer, you know, having my stash exposed out like this, the amount of times I have been shat on, 
Not my career. You got. You just got to take it. And um, yeah, I'm lazy. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Nikita added auto sword for a reason. <laughs> No way, oh my god, for attention. <laughs> Two jungle boxes, the answer, true. <laughs> Hope you don't go out with a bang. I love auto sort. Best addition to the game. <laughs> What's up, Aloha? <laughs> but this is great, man. I'm really happy with, uh, like, whatever happens in the raid number 100. This raid number 100, right? We should have checked. This, this might be 94. No, but... With raid number 100 in the books. This was a fun first 100 raids of the wipe. And one of the most fun wipes I've played. I also like our progress. We didn't go too fast, didn't go too slow. I think we're just at the right pace. For, for me, for me at least. And I will think how... Um, when we come back... Well, we'll see how it goes, but I'm thinking of jumping straight into sniping, maybe. Yeah, it's been a great 100. This is raid number 100, so we'll see. But yeah, technically the 100 raids, this is this is it. Win or lose, we could we could get tapped out of spawn. That's raid number 100. Oh, well, we made it to 100. 11 days, 100 raids. Um, roughly av on average, I would say like 11 days times four, about roughly under 45 hours of gameplay into hopefully one long video for you guys this coming feb or best case late jan but don't pro i can't promise that am i stopping for a bit so that's the thing like a lot of you guys um so so we got a huge shout out on reddit right that, that's like something that i'm like thinking about i would love to i mean it's for me it's not even about like i mean yeah sure writing the momentum but it's more of um I, I would love for people on that reddit thread to see more of our content but um we'll see at the end of the day the videos got us to this point and i want to focus on the video and not you know burn myself out just because we, we got a nice little um little shout out you know uh a lot of people came from reddit today a lot of people were messaging uh were messaging today about a reddit thread that we were we were suggested on um yeah we had a lot of people come come from reddit today and uh Kind of made me think like oh man i kind of want to do do a little more streams and stuff but at the end of the day again i i don't want to compromise the video i'm working on just for the sake of uh you know we'll see though i i will sit down on it and think how how we can go about this but at the end of the day number one priority is that video yeah more sniper videos uh yeah we'll probably return to sniping for sure um Tough spawn. Whoa, 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 whoa. Tough spawn, tough spawn. Yeah, this is a good spot, I think. We just watch our rear for a bit. Let's chill for a bit, see if um, we get any runners from the back here. Lots of shots towards... Uh... It's a lot there. Then again, I don't want to get greedy and just push that. Because we might have a bunch of PMCs of our own here. Sometimes the people who spawn back there play pretty slow. They'll loot everything. And then they'll move. So I won't be surprised if we see movement in a bit here. We'll move on from this angle in a, in a hot second. Let's just see if we could... Match a guy or two here.
Is my stream volume lowered? Um, no, no, no. I don't do anything to my volume. Hey, Luke, much love, dude. That's probably, um, just a scav. Let's one more check here. I'm trying to think where I want to advance to. I'm thinking we go towards those shots, um, 12 o'clock there. I think there's just an AI scav. Feels like one. But where was he? Man, these plants, dude. The amount of times I got debated by a plant today. Oh, it's actually another good angle to check back spawns here. But I think we're clear in the back spawn. I did finish setup yesterday, uh, Solarite. We did it in 10 raids, thankfully. Which also surprised me. I was expecting to do more than just 10. But uh, it was a good day. It was a good day of Tarkov yesterday. I want to get into Spar, uh, Sparja, Sparja, Sparha, Sparja. I don't know how to say it. I forgot. Someone told me how to say it before. A Russian viewer. Was it Sparja? No, it's not Sparja. Ugh. You guys remember how to properly say it? Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay, dude. Okay. 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 Raid number 100, chat. This is raid number 100, and I'm stuck. <laughs> I'm stuck in place. I can't move. What is going on? Welcome to raid number 100. Uh oh, I'm literally stuck. I'm literally stuck. I can't move. But we keep, we're, we're anchored to the floor here. Oh, it's a freaking vacuum of a loot chat. Isn't this, isn't that what it means? Oh no, dude. Act legitimately vacuumed. Is there, how do you know the name? This one weirdo. <laughs> the Gog Gog 3000. <laughs> Man, we. <laughs> Raid number 100 is a cheater, dude. He can't make this up. What do you mean, <laughs> dude? Oh, this is raid number 100. Wait, did we do it right? Is this raid number 99 or 100? It's 100, right? Report, report VoIP. How do I do it again? Oh, the audio just disappeared. This is so dumb, dude. I can't. 
I just want to see if I can, like, can we kill this guy? If he, he's here. It sounds like he's here. I can't move. I'm, wait, can I move now? Yeah, I can't move. I'm stuck. He <laughs> fucking, my audio too. Oh, I mean, if you think, if, this is so, so dumb chat. It's honestly so dumb. Does it end? Like, if he stops vacuuming, does do at least we get to reconnect? I mean, like, reconnect? I don't know. We'll, we'll... Wait, let's try reconnect. F it, dude. Yeah, let's try reconnecting. Might as well. <laughs> That's my first time seeing it, too. I've seen screenshots on Twitter. I've seen people post... Screenshots of that console command. I mean, of, you know. But that was the first time for me as well to see it live. I've, I've seen, um, I've seen it on Twitter. <laughs> Can you VoIP him in time to vacuum my room? It's pretty messy at the moment. Oh, uh, yeah, his name, his name is Weirdo, what chat said. It ends when he leaves map did for me at least let's see i would imagine vacuuming loot i guess that just goes back to rmt i if, if i i really want the gear back if i could get the gear back if I could extract, I would love to run another one. If we do lose, though, I don't really have anything else to run. I mean, we, I mean, yeah, we have the SVD and stuff, but... Man, I really wanted a, a 209 run. But well, we'll see. Exactly. Vaulting to the void now. Vacuum cheater. This is my first time ever coming across this. So I don't mind, like, if, if somehow by a miracle he or, or the raid comes back, I'm down to reconnect. I just. Man, it's annoying. I don't want to rebuild a whole new kit. Well, can't really do anything. What a day indeed. Today, like, so much like today it's it's crazy you can't make this up of how we wrap up our hundred raids with one of the craziest tarkov days <laughs> it's it's a uh, such a tarkov day vaulting cheater died after looting <laughs> getting out of a building what's next What's a Tarkov thing we haven't come across yet? So we, we have the cheater. We have the vault into the void. We got killed right after looting up, exiting a building. We haven't been extract camped yet. <laughs> well, the only loot went from 42 to 35. <laughs> Oh no, you said the thing. Got aimbotted yet? I did, but not today. No, I don't think we got aimbotted yet. Well, we can get aimbotted in this one. Don't worry, I'm on it. <laughs> Vacuum noodles. <laughs> Ruined Tarkov. Broken kneecaps too. Yeah, we're still packet loss. Oh, wait a minute. No way we're back. All right, dude. Either the guy left or... You think they extracted? Wait, 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 wait. For science? For science, chat. There was a weapon crate here. Like, does it mean they vacuumed this too? 
Oh, they just vacuum with the good stuff, I guess, huh? Like the GPUs and stuff. The console. Anyways, let's extract. Let's extract. Clean mob, sewer river. Clean mob, sewer river. Clean mob, sewer river, sewer river, sewer river. Sorry. Brain, 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 brain. This way. Oh, player right there. Someone's jumping. We'll extract, we'll extract. Either extract or we get a fight. If we get a fight, then good. If not, we'll reset. I just saw someone run here. Put all the valuables chat underground so we can all loot it. We're the underground gods. This is the guy I saw earlier for sure. Everyone's just trying to get out. find them. I think I might have just booked it for um, that. I hear him, heard him at least.
Did he cross? And I'm just blind? He definitely didn't cross. He's getting stamina, I think. Oh, there he is. He did, he did move. <laughs> we gotta, I kind of feel bad for shooting him. We should have just let him go with how rough we've all had <laughs> this raid. <laughs> this has been a rough, a rough raid for everybody. Nah, he killed someone here. Yeah, the drop on this bullet's insane. I, was just, I wasn't sure gen generally where I should be aiming there. I'm trying to see if he left or not. I had some questions after watching your vault, but I have no time for asking. Wish you pleasant. Hey, or you, you can always drop it. If you have questions, you can drop it in the comments, man. The YouTube comments. Cheers, dude. Where are those footsteps? This guy's going for Klimov. I could take Klimov too. Anyway, I feel like just let this go if I can't find him. Go for a reset. This guy's probably going to move. Super strange raid anyway. I just don't know the drop on this. The the MOA is really bad. Let's push this fight. The MOA is really really, really strange. That's a scav.
GG, I'll take that out. Those are the PMCs. Raid number 100. We ended on the weirdest raid of all time. We'll take that out. But chat, I'm gonna wrap it up there. I was thinking of doing a reset, but anyway, they're still PMCs. They didn't look like they were cheaters. And uh a fight that I was willing to take and willing to lose. Those are the PMCs though. Pretty convinced those are two PMCs. Uh let's let's double check though. Yeah, PMCs. Th those are the guys I was kinda hunting down, but Again, Echo Rounds should have went for the head. I was kind of going for center mass, but uh, those are Echo Rounds. Nonetheless, chat, that will wrap up the 100 raids of... First 100 raids of the wipe. Um, okay, so just before we, we sign off properly, um, let me let me recap what's going to go, go down, chat, all right? Especially for those of you who are new to the stream. If you, can, if you guys just found us today, yesterday, whatever... So what's happening here if you guys watch the stream you just watch the the hundredth raid right there and what we did i recorded all 100 raids actually 99 99 raids one was off stream in like in the one of the first days 99 of the raids were recorded on stream to be a video um soon uh so right after this stream tomorrow starting tomorrow i'm gonna start working on this video so the streams will take a little break for a bit up until i'm done with this video and release it uh this video is again 100 raids over 44 hours of footage probably somewhere there um maybe 50 hours but that's the plan so uh when will we be back likely the real answer is probably in a couple weeks when we're done with the video but i know um you know i've been a, a I'm, I'm i'm gonna see i, I won't prom i can't promise but i i will see if i can squeeze in maybe a stream or two uh just a casual one just to keep keep in touch with you guys um you know say what's up maybe i uh, can't promise maybe i'll do once a week twice a week maybe once a week just to catch up with you guys give you guys little updates on the video maybe do a couple of casual raids maybe do some squads with people just to you know just to show up so that's kind of the plan right here so um, we have been kind of streaming almost, uh, not I would say daily, but we've been consistently streaming the last couple of weeks for this video. Um, again, for the, uh, it's going to be a video of the story of our first 100 Raids of the Wipe. So that's just a little heads up chat. All right. But uh, yeah, hope um, hope you guys enjoy the, the 100 Raids, man. Uh, this it's, it's cool as well because the last time I streamed this consistent was months back. And to be able to take a big break from streaming and then come back and you guys showing up day in day out we uh not i try not to look at the live stream numbers so much but the live stream numbers have been insane at least in for me um i was expecting a lot less and a lot of you guys came back and there were a lot of new viewers as well new subscribers glad you guys are enjoying the content man but uh, yeah if you guys haven't caught up we, we still have a ton of you can watch back all the live streams from day one to day 11 100 raids in 11 days chat thank you guys for hanging out throughout the 100 raids unfortunate ending there but it's all good i'll take that l that was a good good fight to end and uh yeah it was, it was great it was great chat I'm, I'm really happy i did this really happy i got to reconnect with you guys and bring this live streams back i did honestly burn out from the live streams and um the way we did it recently was a lot of fun and I, I would love to do this more so this is not the last time you will see me live on stream but uh we will be taking a, a quick breather if you guys want to keep in touch though feel free to join the discord um you know maybe if you guys want to squad up with each other while we're out do that i do feel like a lot of you guys in my community are like-minded and you guys might you guys might like each other's company and raid who knows who knows all right before we cry a tear here Let's, let's go sign off chat you guys have a beautiful morning evening afternoon it's currently 9 57 p.m about to grab a late dinner and um hang out with the wife with the dogs and i'll probably start sorting stuff tomorrow start editing soon you guys have a beautiful one chat thank you guys for hanging for the past 11 days we'll be back 100 we'll be back Jeez, everyone